New movie? I love how it says new movie instead of new game. It's very self-aware, at least. <gasps> okay. People said I need to play through the tutorial. Let's see. Behind the scenes? Hi. My name is David Cage. I'm the writer and director of Fine. It's him! I just thought there's a few things you should know before you get started. I'd like you to meet my friend Bob. You'll be controlling Hi, him while you're learning. Let's begin with something simple. Move toward the mark on the floor. Um, Mark? Who's Mark? You're David. Who's Mark? I want to make them start kissing. Oh, you can kind of see there's like a little divot of a little ass cheek on them. Whoa, the camera controls are pretty next gen. I just wanted to put this into perspective for you guys. This game was released in the early 2000s. And you're going to be blown away by how ahead of its time it is. I'm completely serious. Come here, Bob. Perfect. Now you know how to move about. You're also going to have to be able to observe your environment. Observe? So you'll have direct control of the cameras. Come on, give it a try. Yes, this is actually the first game to ever have a story and like narrative devices and characters. Every game that came out before this was basically like Pong and Tetris. Just like moving shapes with no real soul or motive behind anything. Use the L and R buttons to control camera. Oh, I'm doing it. I'm... I think I'm doing it. What did he want me to do? Mm. Kojima wishes he was David Cage. You know what? I'm gonna have to personally agree. Kojima needs to be more French, I think. French people... were pretty much designed to make cinema. You can also look around you and see exactly what you want to see. Exactly what you want to see. I want to see you, David. Look at that eye contact! But you won't be just looking around you in Fire Night. You'll also have to interact with your environment. What? Go to the door. This door right here? Do you see the symbol at the top of the screen? Uh, it indicates yeah. the movement you have to make to execute the action. Do it slowly to really feel you're controlling your character's hand. Go ahead. Use the red analog stick to execute the movement. That is so weird. That's cool. Now that you know how to move That's cool. about, use the cameras <laughs> and interact with the environment, That's cool. we can move on to more serious stuff. <laughs> Fortnite has action sequences where your character's life That's will cool. be injured. I'd better explain this to you before you find yourself on your That's own. That's chill. <laughs> Go to the rib stall. That's what that's called? A rib stall? What the f*** is that? <laughs> Go to it. Okay, I'm going to... I'm gonna do it! I'm gonna execute the movement! I'm executing it! Whoa, what the... When this symbol appears at the top of the screen, it means your character is gonna have to make a physical effort. You'll see. You'll be exhausted too. Uh, what kind of physical effort is he making? Oh, he's working out! <laughs> Holy hey, shit. Not bad. Now for something a bit Let's more difficult. Let's get physical. You're gonna find yourself facing all kinds of dangers in Fahrenheit. You're gonna need a cool head and good reflexes if you want to survive. What's Let's that bug over there? I uh, know, I'm not talking about David. That's what can happen if you don't have good reflexes. Oh, it's I'm sorry, David! Wait, what's... Like this? Okay. It's like Simon says. Ah, well. Okay, you have to press it when it lights up, not when the Failed car again. comes. Have another try. <laughs> Failed again. <laughs> okay, I did it, I did it. <laughs> Failed again. If you can believe it, this game was nominated for 12 awards and won three of them. You're sh Thing me. Did it actually? It. Now we can move on what to something else. What awards did this win? You can also choose what you want to say in the dialogues in Fire Night. Let's give it a try. Okay. Um, what do you think of my friend Bob? 
use the right analog stick to make the... Ooh, I think he's sexy. Uh... Hey, Bob, did you hear that? Right, I see you got to hang up the dial. <laughs> In Final Night, you'll only have a limited amount of time to make up your mind. So you better I don't think, think he fast. has any ears. <laughs> now, let's talk about your mental elf. In Final Night, your actions modify the psychological my, state of my your mental character. elf. Each time it changes, the symbol will appear on screen. There's a mental Take elf. There's an elf character. inside of me. Otherwise, you may fall into depression, madness, or even commit elf, suicide. Elf, baby. Oh, oh, I nearly forgot something important. In Final Did you just say you can you'll kill be able yourself? To control all the main characters. Be careful. Your every action will have consequences for the story. A word of advice: okay. think before you act. Okay, That's David. It. I'll do my best. Everything I know, or nearly everything. Damn, and he's got the. He's got that shit discover, on. Look at those I'll trip leave you pants. The surprise of finding them for yourself. Now it's up to you to play, and be careful. You're entering a world where. Wait, that's your name, Jad Sudoku. Sudoku. Oh, are these rose petals? Okay, so basically, I dodged the car. I opened the rib cage. And there's a little elf inside of my head that if I if it's not happy, I'll kill myself. Things my are mental never quite elf. what they seem. We think we understand the world around us, but we really only see the outside, what it seems to be. I used to be just like you. I believed in humanity, the newspapers, soap commercials, politics, and history books. But one day, the world kicks you in the teeth. <laughs> and you don't have any choice but to see things the way they really are. My name is Lucas Kane. Lucas. My story is the one where an ordinary guy has something extraordinary happen to him. Maybe it was Are supposed soap commercials to lying to us? Maybe it was my destiny or my karma or whatever. I know one thing for sure. Nothing's ever going to be the same again. This is him inside his dad's balls right now. Like just living in an ocean of dad material huh? what city it is this? it all started right here where else could it happen? New York New capital York! Of the, universe. the greatest city the in the world destiny chose for the last big game I was just another pawn living my pawn's life until that night when my life descended into chaos 2001? Uh, guys? <gasps> That's the Statue of Liberty! That's Liberty, there it is. Whoa. I'm just a pawn. The soap commercials lie to me. They say they can make my skin silky smooth and supple. Fuck you, Neutrogena. Fuck you. Ty oh. That's a bad omen. If you're pissing and a crow lands right behind you, that's worse than if your piss splits in half in the morning. This man's actually gonna die, I think. Oh no. No, he's not actually. No, 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 no. Uh, having a rough time on the toilet over there, are we? Maybe it's Maybelline. More like maybe it was the government who killed JFK. <laughs> Tired of the makeup industry's lies. <laughs> Did he just nut? <laughs> No, 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 I was just kidding. Please don't actually... Why is he in a raincoat in his mind? Why 
Why is it making like a rain stick noise? Holy fuck. Who's this child? Hello everybody. David Cage here, extremely less successful brother to Nicholas. I'll do enjoy my game also. Here's an epilepsy warning. What? I guess epilepsy we warning. Didn't know that that in 2005. Wait, shh. my my mental elf, my mental elf is going down. Oh no, if my elf, the elf inside me gets sad, I'm going to kill myself. We have I, to be careful. I didn't want... It was like a dream. <laughs> Bro, his reaction to killing someone in a public bathroom is like me when I accidentally spill on the floor. Quick. I Oh, I've, I've oh darn it. Before somebody comes in here. Oh jeez, this is so embarrassing. Oh man, this never happens to me. I I I swear. When this icon is upper right corner so your progress is automatically saved on the hard drive. Okay. Wait, oh no, what am I gonna do about my mental elf? Yeah, let's hide the evidence. Like... <laughs> okay, that, that helped my mental elf a little bit. Are you happy, little elf? Yes! Thank you for hiding the body in the toilet! Now I'm not gonna make you kill yourself! Wait, can I beep it? He didn't even shake it to get the droplets out. Bro, that's not gonna help your mental elf. What's in here? No, no way. Oh, he's just... <laughs> Ding dong! <laughs> Anybody home? <laughs> Please tell me I can piss again. If I can piss... What is the... The oh. knife. I've got to get rid of it. Flush it down the toilet. Oh shit! Someone's coming! There's a fucking cop! Wait, he's on break though. He's in chill mode. Okay, my mental elf has plus five. Plus five points. Wait, what did he do with the knife? Did he... Okay, wash... Bro, wash the blood off your hands. And your face. I'm covered in blood. I, I can't go anywhere looking like this. <laughs> This is like my mental, like my inner monologue when I wake up in the morning with ADHD in full swing and I'm trying to like operate myself and remind myself of everything I have to do at the start of my day. Like, okay, I have to go wash my face. All right. Okay, now I'm going to take a piss. Okay, and then I'm going to walk into the kitchen and get some water. And then after I drink some of the water, I'm going to go on my computer and check my Welcome emails. Welcome to Indigo Prophecy, where nothing makes sense and the logic is made up. Fucking classic. Bro, well, this game is already a cinematic masterpiece. I'm... I'm washing my face. Wait, is everything... Everything is not... He's clean. Out of order. Wait, can I dry my hands too? <laughs> oh god, the police officer's coming in here! Oh, shit, I gotta get out, I gotta get out. Ha, ha, ha. Wait, 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 there's like a mop in a bucket here? Get out the window! Come on, you it's stupid bitch! I can't get out this way. Wait, why is he jumping? Oh, oh no, my mental health! Oh. Uh, what's it going, officer? Uh... Uh, sorry, I had, had a little bit of an accident in here. He, is he gonna... Oh no, this is embarrassing. This is actually so cringe. Oh no, I, I can explain, alright? It wasn't me! You are under arrest. He you had a... Right to his tummy silent. hurt. His tummy Anything hurt. Anything you say can and will be used against you. Ah, shit. And that's how my story ends. Oh I'll be spending God. the rest of my days rotting in some prison somewhere. I'll never know exactly what happened to me that cold night in January <laughs> in the toilet of an East End restaurant. Because as far as everyone else is concerned, I'm just, just a killer. Just keeps going. 
and then I'm gonna I'm gonna spend ten years in jail, and uh, maybe work out a little, get super buff, maybe get some prison tats, and then I'm gonna get released, and the world is gonna change a lot from when I was in prison. I'm gonna miss all my friends and family. They're not gonna want to reconnect with me because they think I'm a cold-blooded murderer. Then I'm gonna try to reintegrate into society, and but nobody's gonna give me a job. How do I continue? Okay, now we speed run this shit. Yeah, my elf is gonna be really upset with me. Yeah, maybe my mental elf could testify for me in court. She was feeling very depressed today. It wasn't her fault. This is a bad day. Yeah, we can't make the elf sad, you guys. Yeah, there's like a little duende inside of me. I don't need to dry my hands. I mean, what is the police officer gonna do? Be like, Oh, your your hands are wet. Why are they wet? Did you kill someone? Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to do that. clean my apartment i can feel my mental elf going up like so high wait it's still bro it's st oh murky bunkster thank you murky thank you for the for 10 fucking gifted how do i okay i gotta clean i gotta clean thank you thank you I'm so bleeding. much i must have cut my wrist with a knife both of my forearms are cut too me in middle school. Okay, come on, come on, clean the rest of it. Or maybe I should. Should I just leave? Yeah, I want to. I want to piss. The knife! I gotta hide the knife. Is it in here? Where was it again? Where the fuck is it? Where is the knife? Here it is. The knife. I've got to get rid of it. The knife. ADHD serial killer. <laughs> Wait, we're making good time now. We're making good time now. This cutscene played... Uh... Before we did way... Like, a ton of this shit. Okay, now we can just leave. Right? Like... What's the worst that could happen? He's not gonna see me leave. The cop. He's going to find the body in the restroom. I've got to get out of here right now. Yeah, get, get uh, out, that's hey, it. Sir, your bill! Uh-oh. Oh, shit. I need to get out of this neighborhood before the police get here. Okay. Uh, run, 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 run! How do I get out of this neighborhood? Oh god, he's gonna... Okay, he's seeing the blood on the floor. Why didn't I do a better job of mopping? Oh my god, I'm such a fucking failure! Too far away to walk. I have to find another way to get back home. <laughs> Nobody goes anywhere. This is too real. The crime has just been committed. I'm going to have to ask you to stay calm. Is that a subway station? For the police to right, arrive like a greyhound? Right here? <gasps> Horsepower. My mental elf got plus 10 points. My mental elf is smiling with glee right now. Tasha, I'm not gonna make you kill yourself now. Whoa, who's this guy? Do you think he knows what we did? He kind of seems like a knower. Uh oh. Oh no. Diner. That's it. Is there a way to turn on subtitles? Go on duty before they start killing each other in the middle of the night. Tyler, somebody gets murdered every day in New York. But especially when I'm on night duty. It's as if every psycho in the city has it in for me. <laughs> if you want a bitch, do it inside. That way I don't have to freeze to death listening to it. Jeez, lady. <laughs> You're the boss, Carla. Wait, now I'm a girl. In five years on the force, I've seen some murders. But 
You never really get used to death. You just learn to live with it, that's all. I still don't know if it was fatigue, cold, or something else. Where are all the people? Maybe I inside because it's like a blizzard. I bad feeling I got when I walked into that restaurant. You have boobs As and a pussy now. That that's kind of cool. Something was different. I wonder if her mental elf is How better or worse. Evening, Inspector. I've been waiting for you. Hey, Tyler. Hey, Martin. So, Why do they look like Sims? What happened? Homicide. I found the body in the toilets. <laughs> Damn, to go do not go in there. <laughs> uh, Did anybody this? notice anything strange? No, nobody saw anything. Do we have a suspect? A client left just before I found the body. To top it all, he left without Should paying. have a health inspector Kid come here. To talk to him, then he or left. an elf inspector. Oh, uh, the victim. Who was the victim? His name was, uh, John Winston. A regular here at the restaurant. That is such a made-up name. Knew she could tell you more. Who is named John Winston? What were you doing here? Were you on duty? I wasn't. I just happened to be here when the murder happened. Oh, really? I like to come here after work. Really Kid now? the best in the East End. Uh, what about the, Is waitress? That the waitress over there? Yeah, Kate Morrison. Oh no, she's I think probably that you traumatized. Should interrogate her. If you don't mind me saying, go easy on her, Inspector. Oh. She's still in a state of shock. Oh, Which no. table was the suspect sitting at? Oh, he was sitting at that table over there. Thanks for your help, Martin. If I had ate that food, I'd kill someone to too. I'm gonna wait until you're finished with Kate, if you don't mind. I want to make sure she gets home okay. When the symbol appears at the top right, you can switch characters, press the B button. Okay, what is the B button on a PlayStation controller? <laughs> okay, I think the waitress needs a woman's touch, you know, someone gentle. Circle? Okay, okay, okay. Kate? I'm Inspector Carla Valenti. I'm in charge of the investigation here. Let's Would do good cop, bad cop with her. No. Go ahead. Uh, you. Have you been working here long, Kate? We gotta ease her into it. It'll be eleven it. years next month. I've seen Yuri all sorts time? of this place. What down the and fuck? Junkies, you name it. God Until damn! I can't wait to see these two hotties start making out. <laughs> Me, whenever I see two girls in the same room together. Oh. Nice this girl in shock after seeing a murder victim? You know Holy victim fuck. What if she, her and the cops regular. just started fucking kissing Came and finger banging each yeah, other? The <laughs> and left a nice tip. Uh... What was he like, Kate? Was he Do nice? Do you think you could describe him for me? I only saw him for a few seconds. I guess he was about average height, fairly young. Oh, so he's about like 6'5". I see. I can remember. Hmm. Could anyone else have come in? No, uh, I don't think so. You can only get in the front door. I like the smiley face if on her name else tag. Had come in, I would have seen them. Um, was John here alone? Yeah, was he Did alone? Did he speak with anyone? John always came alone. We chatted a bit. And the weather, his Kate. job, the usual stuff. Oh, he never it... talked to anybody else. Do you know whether the victim had any enemies? Anybody that might want to kill him? Oh no. John was just a nice, normal guy. I can't see why anybody would want to kill him. Yeah, he seemed pretty chill. Did you hear anything while John was in the toilets? The sound of a struggle or yelling? <laughs> yeah, I heard no, him groaning. I didn't notice anything. <laughs> Can you tell me what you saw? There weren't that many people tonight. <laughs> it was usually pretty calm during the week. I was just chatting with Martin at the bar. I didn't even see John get up. Oh my God. Oh no. Let's do her. Try to be strong, Kate. I know that yeah, this we is can't, a shock. We can't you, break her yet. You're the only one who can help us find the suspect. My shift was almost over. I was just chatting with Martin at the bar. John got up and went to the restroom. The man must have followed him. When he came back out, I noticed that he hadn't paid his bill. I'm careful, because that happens a lot here. People forgetting to pay their bill. What happened next? The guy just ran off without paying. What if they just started rubbing their Tomorrow butts together and farting on each it. other? Oh! 
Did you happen to notice anything strange about John tonight? Did he seem worried or stressed out? No. It was a normal day. Just like he always is. He even made a joke when he came in. What did Do you he say? Think that you would recognize the suspect. What was the joke? I'll never forget that face. Perfect. I'm so bad at interrogating people. Do you think that you could come and help us construct a likeness of the killer? Yeah. What was the joke? Yeah. You only was hanging, I'll do Kate. Whatever you think I can to help catch him? Thank you very much for your help, Kate. Oh, she doesn't want to steal the joke. I hope you find the bastard who did it. People like that just don't deserve to live. I promise you, we'll do everything in our power to find him. Go I love when try to get some sleep. Like in a video game cutscene, sure when home. the actor stops talking and their face just reverts to a neutral expression immediately, like. And <laughs> then <laughs> oh no, I don't know if I did a good job interviewing her. Good night. I just felt awkward, you know, because she was so sad. I didn't want to, like, upset her. Should I switch to the other dude? Wait, NYPD. Hey, Garrett. Hey, Frank. How's it going? Garrett and hey, Frank. Carla. Hey, Carla. So, you guys find anything? We took some samples here and there. We're almost finished. We were just waiting for you before we took the body away. I heard okay, the victim said a joke a shortly before he died. Do you happen to know what it was? And was it funny? How many people laughed? Well, I'm gonna go back in the kitchen and make myself something. Make myself some coffee. This is so immersive. You actually had to like move the joystick in like certain configurations to do an action instead of just pressing one button. So it actually feels as if you're doing it. I feel like I'm actually this character right now. Oh, Carla needs coffee to help her mental elf. My mental elf runs on coffee. If I don't drink my coffee, I'm going to kill myself. How much can she drink? Jeez, Carla! Holy, she just down that entire thing. She's gonna have coffee piss tonight. Wait, that's the blizzard on the, the weather channel. This is just a game, I know it's realistic, but please, you must stay in the real world. What do you mean, the real world? We're not in it right now? I'm not at Doc's diner, drinking co coffee? But the coffee felt so warm on my on my mouth, and it tasted so decadent. It was expertly brewed. Let's go take a look in the restroom. Uh... Who said you could come in here? Oh my god, it's awful! Oh! Somebody forgot to flush. Oh, and there's a dead body too. Wait, should we be? Several wounds on the left side of the chest, in the area of the heart. Don't touch they it. It has germs. Nothing. I would still poop here. Yeah, it's like when you put toilet paper on a public toilet to protect yourself, but you could just like kill someone, put their dead body on the toilet instead, and then poop through them, no like sit on their lap. Struggle. Looks like the guy was taken totally by surprise. <laughs> Happens to me all the time in the bathroom, you know? Sometimes, uh... Things just kinda hit you. The way you don't expect. Blood on the mop. The killer must have used it to clean up the mess. This killer must have been a Why fucking dumbass. Why did get caught to do that? <laughs> this killer must have had some kind of, like, brain problem. Wow, I look so hot today. Oh my god. Let me fix my hair. Hmm. Yeah, my makeup's on point. Yeah, it's whatever though. I woke up like this. Hey. Uh. So about the dead body. Can I touch the toilet? Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Man, stab some dude in the toilets? You gotta be crazy. This guy took a big risk. <laughs> Anybody could have walked in here and surprised him. <laughs> You're telling me. I know David Cage gets a lot of flack, but I do like all the detective stuff in his games, like with Connor and Norman. Yeah, honestly, these are the best part of these games. He's really good at, like, detective drama. 
like playing a CSI episode. Wait, what? Can I just start pissing in front of her? Oh. Tyler? What? This is a restroom, isn't it? No, this is a crime scene. It's cool, I'm done. It's cool. Must be all that coffee I've been drinking to try and stay awake. Oh no, I decreased her mental health. I made her stressed. Do women really get like stressed if you piss in front of them? Oh no, fuck Tyler, what have we done? Oh god. Bizarre. What? Well, he still has his credit card and a hundred bucks in cash on him. Hmm. I guess the killer wasn't after his money. Yeah. I wonder what the motive could be. He didn't even wash his hands. I feel like it makes way more sense for a guy to wash their hands after peeing versus like... You know, someone who doesn't have to touch Do stuff down there. you contacted the family? Not as far as I know. Oh, right. I get it. I'll Tyler! This is a crime scene! I couldn't hold it in! Oh, Tyler. Uh, Carla. Carla, she's really something else. She's not always easy to get along with, but she's the best damn cop I know. Wait, do you think he has feelings for her? Did you find anything, Tyler? <sighs> For that, I'd have to be able to keep my eyes open. He pissed out keep all the, the good coffee. Work, Tyler. Come on, let's go, Carla. I can't even keep my eyes open anymore. <laughs> I want to take another look around. We haven't found a murder weapon. It might still be around here somewhere. I don't want to be at the murder scene anymore. I'm tired. My feet hurt. I want to go home. <laughs> this is lame. I want to play Xbox. It's pretty funny seeing you on the job at this hour, Tyler. What, you fall out of bed? <laughs> yeah, don't make me laugh, Garrett. My lips are chapped. <laughs> God, why you is he whining all the time like a yeah, bitch? this is my third night on call in a row. You know me, man. If I don't get my beauty sleep, it's zombie city. Ah, uh, you should be out of here pretty soon now. You don't know Carla. Bro, this she's guy is literally of me. everybody up till breakfast. Man, she's uh, by far kinda. the most stubborn girl I ever met. If I had to be a fucking cop, I would be this guy. I'd be so fucking tired all the time, just complaining about everything. <gasps> what kind of music they got? Oh, Tyler, can you shut that thing off? We're on a murder site here. Hey, I just thought I'd chill the atmosphere a little. Okay. It's oh off. no, I his turn this off before his Carl mental health. Why did he just unplug it? <laughs> Wait, I think she liked it though. Did you see that little smirk? I think she was into it. We almost had like a little moment there. Bro, can they get together? Him and Carla. Just gonna invite some friends over nice and play Smash <laughs> into the murder scene bar. <laughs> hey guys, it's happy hour. <laughs> there's nobody. There's and literally this nobody here. Dying proof that pissing can be bad for your health. What? Oh, 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 what? Wait, is this the the suspect? Strange. He never Coffee's paid his bill. bill. This guy is a no piss Chad. Steak and fries. Looks like he barely touched his food. Hungry, Tyler? Martin says this was the guy's table. Hmm. I wonder why he didn't pay his bill. Maybe it's because he murdered someone in the bathroom and didn't want to get caught. Let's have Carla take a look at it. Uh... Is she gonna have like an introspective moment sitting here? No. Yeah, that steak looks, uh, interesting for sure. Huh. Hmm. Here's his fork, but where's the knife? <gasps> he used the knife? 
A cup of coffee and a soft drink? That's weird. He's a caffeine addict, or else he wasn't what? alone. Is that weird? To have a cup of coffee and a soft drink? <gasps> What's this? Oh. A Tempest by Shakespeare. If this is his, it's a pretty weird book for a killer to be reading. Garrett, there's a book under this table. Why don't you check it out for Prince? You got oh. it, Carla. Who's Prince? Another police officer? Guys, I found some evidence. You're not gonna believe this. He reads Shakespeare. Finger points. <laughs> no, thank you. Wait, should I go back in the bathroom or talk to Tyler? Do I have to switch to Tyler to... Tyler's been my partner for almost a year. He grew up with the gangs in the Bronx before he decided to join the force. Well, I Sometimes didn't find the knife. but he's a good guy. Where did we hide the knife again? I don't remember. I, I was panicking the entire time. They didn't show us? Fuck. Yeah, didn't, didn't he just take it? Didn't he just like put it into his coat? Yeah, he, he took it. It doesn't show, so you have to look for it. I... I thought he took it. Let's take a look around. Maybe he threw it into the trash can. Maybe he threw it out the window. What about this stall right here? Oh, strange. Can't open it. Hmm. Strange. There's a dead body in here. Hmm. I see it. Hmm. Strange. What if she did the piss thing too? And he's like, Carla. Carla. Maybe it was a revenge thing, or a psycho. This town is full of psychos. They're everywhere. When I was in the Bronx, I saw guys who'd rip your guts out and hand them to you just so they could take your shoes. Tyler, can you shut up for two minutes? <laughs> Tyler. <laughs> Bro. Come on, let's go, Carla. I can't even keep my eyes open anymore. Yeah, we gotta go do prints. Let's take another look around. We haven't found the murder weapon. It might still be around here somewhere. Maybe it's outside. Maybe he dropped it when he was fleeing. Where the fuck is the murder weapon, guys? Tyler, I'm gonna take a look outside. Oh, I see. I see a blood trail. Did he throw it into this dumpster? Come on, Carla. Wait, who's this? Good evening, sir. <gasps> did you see anyone run past Whoa. here? It's this guy! <laughs> the, 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 he did see him! He did, he did, he did! <laughs> what can I do for you? Uh, have you seen anything? Someone was killed in that restaurant tonight. Did you happen to see anything or anyone unusual? Did I see something? <laughs> I don't see nothing. I mind my own business. My name is Carla Valenti. And you? You What's have to name? seduce him, Carla. My name? <laughs> he does kind of sound like the Resident Evil guy. What the hell is my name? <laughs> Nobody uses it anymore. Guess I just forgot it. <laughs> yeah, oh, Bogart. Yes, and, uh, my friends call me Bogart. Bogart. <laughs> Must be because I look so much like that actor fella. <laughs> Who? Okay. Who? I'm gonna go try to get someplace warm. Take uh, care of yourself. Why did that make her mental health go down? Does Carla hate homeless people? Not I cool, saw Carla. Someone. Who? Who did you see, Bo uh, Bogard? Or rather, something. Nobody remembers him, but I saw him. I saw him come out the back door. Ah, oh, it was evil. The devil himself. What did he look like? Can you describe him? Huh? Who? Uh, who? You drink too much, baby. You, you, you're talking nonsense. <laughs> <laughs> nonsense. <laughs> Bro, she raises her eyebrows suggestively at everything 
I think she just had like Botox or something and can't really control her facial expressions. Okay, what do we uh He did cut himself, maybe he left like a blood trail. Can I just like make it so he gets off scot-free and isn't apprehended by just making the police really really bad at their job? Yeah, let's just go home, Carla. I'm tired. My lips are chapped. My feet hurt. I need to find the murder weapon. Not much chance of finding anything this far from the restaurant. What? Was it? I was even in the restaurant. Okay, I'm gonna go back inside. I saw a homeless man. He said that he saw someone evil. The door only opens from the inside. Interesting. Hmm. Wait, what if he threw it out the window right here? What if we can't find the murder weapon? What if this is a wild goose chase and I'm just fucking stupid? Yeah, I got minus 10 on my elf. There's three endings and they don't change based on the murder part? Oh, I see. Yeah, I think... Yeah, I took the... I'm pretty sure he took the knife with him. Can you leave it behind and have them discover it? Does that change much? Tyler, we have to go! Come on, let's go. Carla, I can't even keep my eyes open anymore. Yeah, I want back to another look around. We haven't found the murder weapon. It might still if be If we want to experience as much of the cutscenes as fast as possible, I need extreme backseating. As much as possible. Oh, well, I'm tired. I want to go. I want to go buddy boy. I want to drink some warm milk and get tucked into my little waist call bed. Okay, switch to Tyler. Find trash in the bathroom. Okay, 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 okay. Tyler, it's your time to shine. Oh, okay. <laughs> He's just running at full speed, just knocking everything over. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this right here. How come I couldn't inspect this as Carla? I tried to and nothing came up. Is Carla just averse to just putting her hands exactly in trash? Are you doing, Tyler? She's such Object a prissy clues, bitch. Because it's a men's room trash can, it might have like men's stuff in it. Ugh. What would a man throw away in the bathroom? I feel like a girl's restroom trash can would be even way more sketch. Based on just based on what girls have to throw away sometimes. Hey, I think uh... there's some blood in the sink. <laughs> Maybe the killer washed up before he left. Yeah, could be. Oh yeah. Looking good, Tyler. Good job. Blood in a murder scene. Oh. <gasps> he forgot to flush. That would be so embarrassing. Like, not just murdering someone, but like taking a shit in the bathroom and the police find it and they're like, hmm, looks like the suspect left some dropping behind. And they have to scoop it up and bring it back to the lab. Can they actually like DNA t test you based on your shit? Like, if you left a deuce at the crime scene, could they be like, we found our man? Maybe I need to go outside and talk to the homeless guy as Tyler. Because the homeless guy was getting kind of weird with Carla. Maybe like if it's like a man-to-man -man talk. Hey Carla, I'm gonna take a look outside, see if I can find anything. All right, time to go home. <laughs> oh, I'm so tired. Yo, what do you want? Mm -hmm. I was wondering. You didn't happen to see anything unusual tonight, did you? Ah, leave me alone. I got nothing to say. I don't talk to cops. <laughs> oh, no. Right. Thank you. You've been helpful. Oh, come Why did you talk to Carla then? What's special about her? Is, is she prettier than me? Wait. There's a thing. Footprints. Hey, footprints. Footprints! Maybe they belong to the killer. Yes. 
Don't step on them. You're gonna, you're gonna muck it up. Huh, bloody piece of cloth. <gasps> From Maybe where? The lab guys could get something out of it. Yeah, 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 yeah. More evidence, more evidence. Yeah. It's keto. <laughs> more flavors. <laughs> Wait, it's, there's blood right here, isn't there? Like, from this camera angle, it looks like there's blood on the snow. What is this alien store? Medium. Oh, no point in going channel. any further. I'm gonna head back to the restaurant. Oh, well, okay. But what about following the footprints, Tyler? Bogus, bogus Benson, Dabbies. <laughs> Snow day! Woo! <laughs> snowball fight, Kawa! Watch out! <laughs> we am gonna throw a snowball at you, Kawa! Shit, man! <sighs> what the fuck? I searched the trash and it wasn't in there! So... Is that all we need to do? Can we go home now? Come on, let's go, Kala. I can't even keep my eyes open anymore. Kawa, I wanna take another look around. Kala, you bitch! We haven't found the murder weapon. It might still be around here What somewhere. the fuck do I do? Crevice and left stall floor. Oh. By the vent? <laughs> Carla, please let me go. I'm so sweepy. Wait, why is he walking into the wall like that? He got like stuck walking into the wall. <laughs> I love how she has to like... <laughs> follow him around everywhere. To make sure he's on task. She's like, <laughs> she's like his mom. Okay, the crevice right here, right? How do I look at it though? I noticed that earlier, but there's no like prompt to look at anything. Do I need to be Carla to do it? What's so special about Carla? Tyler, get out of the way. Look. <gasps> now I can look at it. Why is there blood here? Did you find anything? Possibly. I don't understand why there would be blood here. Maybe it belongs to the victim. Not likely. Get Garrett to analyze it. Then we'll know but for why sure. Why is it not likely? How does she know? Like, why Why wouldn't there be blood there? There could be blood all over the place if there was like a struggle. A table knife covered in blood. Obviously the murder weapon. <gasps> she found it! Killer Let's go! Killer used silverware to stab his victim. That would seem to indicate that the murder wasn't. Why would blood get another stall? Maybe it just splashed over there. Tyler, there's a knife hidden here. It might be the murder weapon. Get Garrett. Yeah, Make blood sure can kind of just and go places. She okay. found the poop knife. <laughs> Bro, what if that's the reason he killed that guy? Because he's the type of person that like takes a knife with him into the bathroom to cut his poop up into like the like little pieces so it flushes more easily because he didn't want to clog the toilet because he'd get really embarrassed and then the guy saw him do it and he's like oh you have to die and just killed him with a poop knife i'm sorry john john winston i think they called him john because it's like a funny little pawn because he died on the toilet give me the cheese <laughs> okay i'll give you the cheese on one condition you have to wake up, casual sleepy gamer. Wake up! Wake the fuck up! You okay, we can go, leave now. I think I've seen everything I need to see. Yay, thank you, mommy. Are you sure? We can take another look around if you want. No, we're good. We're good. Let's head home. Yeah, I found everything. Okay, let's bust. It's time to get back to the car. Why did he say that? I'm dead tired. Even after drinking all that coffee, Carla? All right, let's go back to our little vehicle. They have a pretty interesting car for undercover cops. It looks kind of ostentatious, doesn't it? Like, look at the... look at that! What kind of car even is that? Whoa, Camaro? An old Camaro? He says he's tired, but you know you're gonna stay up all night playing Xbox. Hey, what the fuck is up with that? Can anyone explain this fucking phenomenon to me? 
people who are like, Oh, I'm so tired. I want to go to bed right now. And then they stay up for like four more fucking hours doing God knows what on their fucking Xbox. Oh, I'm so tired. <laughs> yeah, I do that a sometimes. It was all just I don't even know why I do it. I didn't kill anyone. Me when I woke up this morning. In my boxers with my... Uh... Big feet. <laughs> I wasn't dreaming. This is the average VTuber fan who <laughs> gets like really, really I mad about the stupidest shit. <laughs> oh, my head. Why didn't Takora win in the VTuber Awards? Why? Hollow Life should sue. Why is there- he, he is a very messy boy. Like, if I was gonna murder people and be, like, really psychotic about it, I'd at least be, like, clean and not sleep in a bloody bed. The sheets are full of blood. I can't go back to bed. I'm not tired anyway. Really? <laughs> okay, bro, why don't you, uh, take a little shower? Oh god. We have to make sure his mental elf is okay. I've got a bad feeling about it. <gasps> oh! Oh no, my phone is ringing. I hope they don't know what I did last night. Answer it. Can you just... Hello? ignore it? Lucas, it's good to hear from you. I thought I'd call to find out if maybe you wanted to go to Mom and Dad's tomb together. And, to be honest, I thought it might be a good excuse to get back in touch with you. I need to see you, Marcus. I'm in big trouble. What are you talking about, Lucas? What happened? Lucas! I can't really talk about it on the telephone. It's serious, Marcus. Why are his eyes so big? See you there. Yeah, this is, uh... How much do you think his rent is? This is in New York in, like, 2005. Pretty freaking spacious. He has an electric guitar. Can he play? After what happened last night, I'm not really in the mood to play the guitar. What? Come on, man. For real? You don't want to play your electric guitar with your cut-up arms? Oh, he has a punching bag. I'm in no condition. My forearms still hurt. <laughs> Stop making excuses. You have to get up and grind, bro. I don't care if you killed someone last night and cut your wrists. Oh no. Oh my god, he has like a little a little mat with cute little dolphins and shit on it. Is this really his apartment? <laughs> Bro, he's, it's, it's like Gap Moy. He's like this depressed like loner guy who killed someone and he's trying really hard to seem like mysterious and edgy, but his bathroom looks like a fucking middle-aged woman's bathroom. <laughs> Still kind of damp. Jeez, I can never tell if it's dry or if it's just kind of cold. You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? Is he gonna shower in his boxers? That is so gross. Maybe he's a never nude. Better than your bathroom? What are you? Why are you talking shit about my bathroom? You don't even know what my bathroom looks like. He really did. Shower in his boxers. Okay, maybe now he can change into some warm clothes. No, no. Put a shirt on, at least, brother. When you take a, a piss, does it really give you like plus five to your mental elf, like in real life? It does kind of make sense, I guess. Wait, what if he has to take his meds? Oh, it's bandage. Yeah, you know what? Sometimes I'll be in a bad mood, then I'll go take a piss and I instantly feel a little better. Oh, he has those like fingerless gamer girl gloves on now. It's 
It's nothing. It's uh, I might be seeing things. Here, let me uh take a look at myself. Taking a piss is basically therapy. You know what? As weird as it sounds, I'm gonna have to agree. It's just kind of nice to have like a nice quiet moment to yourself to sit and reflect and just let things go. It literally takes weight off of you. Like you have more of a prep in your st Oh no, what's happening, Lucas? Lucas, why is your mental health decreasing? The what is key? key? To my apartment. I'll grab it when I'm ready to leave. Okay. Why do the keys to your apartment look like an old timey mansion key from like the 1800s? Okay, why don't you watch some TV? Oh no, what if he turns on the news and it's like a man was the killed? Man oh, was discovered in the restroom of an East oh, turn it off, Lucas! Lucas, turn it off! Your mental health, no! Well, just yards away, other customers were coming. <laughs> oh, stop watching it, Lucas! Trail of a suspect who fled the scene just before the oh. body was discovered. Police have no other comment for the time being. Are you sitting there in his fucking tidy whiteies? The news is boring. I wonder what's Animal Planet. No. No, Lucas. Lucas! Lucas, snap out of it! Think about your mental elf. What would your mental elf want? Yes. Well, thank you, Stoma Fart. <laughs> <laughs> the suspect was probably a huge dumbass <laughs> and a total fucking loser. Okay, the thing that bothers me the most about this guy, he is definitely a psychopath because why the fuck is his TV in the middle of the room? Police. Please open the door. <gasps> Get ready! <laughs> Why is it like Simon says? What the fu- I only gave hey, it- what's that? Stay where you are and put your hands in the air. It said great. I think I- These images in my head are- It said great, so I, I passed it, right? Mind. Okay, I have to go hide all that shit. Um, uh, go upstairs and uh- <sighs> go, 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 no, 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 go in here, go in here. Wait, wait, wait. There is nothing bloody in here, right? Um... Wait. Oh god, I don't remember. Oh god, I don't remember. Lucas? Lucas, we're in big trouble! Big trouble in little China. What if he just runs away right now? Wait, that's the front door. Okay, okay, okay. This is his bedroom. How long is this cop gonna wait? Okay, okay, we have to get rid of the bloody sheets and the bloody sweater you were wearing. This will hide the blood in case anyone comes in the room. Y I'll change the sheets later. Y yeah, okay, Lucas. Cool. Good job, Lucas. Very cool. Um, put on a shirt. Put on some clothes, Lucas. You gotta cover up the wounds on your arms so the police officer isn't like, what happened? Okay. Okay. This is up. Wait, where was the bloody sweater? It was like on the floor somewhere. Come on. Where the fuck was it? The police officer is gonna come in. Ah, uh, shit. Is he ready now? Oh fuck. What if I just go on my computer? Not right now. I'm on my computer. Thus spoke, spoke Zarathustra by Nietzsche. He reads I've Nietzsche. I've read it so many times, I know half of it by heart. Of course you did, Lucas. Of course you did. Go on your laptop and post on Reddit now! New York police. Oh god. <gasps> Here it is. Here's the... <laughs> they know. They, they've come to arrest me. They don't know. They don't know anything. Here. Oh god. Look at those cloth physics, though. Please, open up. Okay. Just a minute. I'm coming. Roll this in the. I can't let them find any evidence linking me to last night. I've got a couple seconds to hide everything before I get the door. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. A couple seconds. Uh. Sir. 
This is the New York police. I uh, must insist that you open this door immediately. Uh, wash your hands. Wash your wash the bubba 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 bubba. Wash the bubba. Wash your bubbs. Hey, this should be more than enough time. I already hid the bloody bed sheets. Like, what's the cop gonna do? Be like, can I see your bed? Can I see the bed that you sleep you in every night? Open the door right now. I will be forced to knock it down. Wait, what if I open it right now? I I hit everything, right? Like, what else was there? Make coffee of time. Okay. Make coffee now. Uh, that's soup. Wait. Wait, 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 the prongs, the prongs are coming up, right? Oh, stop it. Yeah, just pretend you were casually drinking some water. Uh, okay. Wait, that gave me more mental elf. That helped my mental elf, actually. Okay, is there anything else in here? Anything else? Anything? Anything? Just open the door. Yeah, what if I just started playing the guitar? Just a second. I'm looking for the keys. Don't move. Ah, I didn't know. I needed to, 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 to use the key on the That's inside. Story ends. Ah! The neighbors called the cops because they heard shouts. Why do I have to? New York what? Police. Please open the door. Okay, at least it starts here. Why Please. the fuck do they I have to they, open they my own me. door from the inside with a fucking key? Is that like a French thing? Is that how they do it in Police, France? Open up. Okay, now Just I'll have more time to make coffee. I can't let them find any evidence linking me to last night. I've got a couple seconds to hide everything before I get the door. Okay. Stay calm, Lucas. Here's what we're gonna do. You can Sir, hide the bloody material the York in the laundry machine. I must insist that you open this door I'm gonna grab the keys. Got the key? Okay, good. Nice job, Lucas. Just casually take it. Okay, now we're gonna go over to the kitchen. Stay calm. We're gonna make a pot of coffee. Oh, what's that? If you do not open the door right now, I will be forced to knock it down. Don't knock it down, please! Please, sir! Please, sir, no! Oh shit, I opened the same one again. Fuck! I got a Yu-Gi-Oh cloud! How the fuck? Can I not make coffee? There's a coffee machine right there. This is actually p p p pretty stupid. This is your last warning. <laughs> Open the door now! Play the guitar or now! What happens if you just leave out the balcony or the window? You'll definitely get caught then, right? Oh shit, I didn't drink the water. Sorry, I was just practicing for the Battle uh, of the I'm Bands. I'm sorry to make you wait like that. I, I was in the shower. Are you Lucas Kane? Yes. Mr. Kane, the neighbors heard <laughs> yelling dressed. from your apartment. <laughs> I was in the shower, Is there sorry. A problem? Uh... Yelling? No, there must be some mistake. I'm alone here, and I was sleeping. Would it be alright if uh, I took a little oh. look around your apartment? Uh, yeah. <sighs> Whatever. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's cool, that's cool, that's casual. He's gonna be like, Oh, this guy seems chill. He's just letting me right in. What happened uh, to your wrist, sir? Wait, how does he know? Oh, it's nothing. Just a stupid accident. Holy oh, shredding guitar you too hard. Yourself. You go all the way, don't you? What? You can see just my hands, but maybe I just like, I don't know. Yeah, it looks normal, huh? Normal bathroom. Nice bath mat. Where did you get that? Kmart? Or maybe Bed Bath & Beyond? Uh, it was on sale. Uh, I don't really like it. I don't like, like, dolphins or anything. That's kind of gay. Hmm, sure. Wait, his suspicion went way down! It's just a normal Thank little bachelor pad, huh? Uh, sorry to have bothered you, sir. You know how it is. With everything that's been going on, uh, we prefer to be careful. I understand. Go on, Mr. Kane. Thank you, sir. Okay, now we can practice for Battle of the Bands. Ah, oh, nice job, Lucas. 
We made it. Wait, why is my cursor on screen? <laughs> she starts saying it too, like, what the f what the fuck is that? Oh god, I'm tired of seeing things. I'm going fucking crazy. Now we can watch the Animal Planet channel. Oh wait, it's that crow. The crow that was there when the man died. Maybe he knows something. Okay, this is is this gonna help his mental elf or harm it? <laughs> Bro, the way he just stands there. Wait, I just got a bonus. <laughs> cool. <laughs> My honest reaction. Why does he stand like that? Okay, now are you feeling better enough to punch the punching bag? Or are you just gonna be a little whiny baby about everything? Oh, I killed someone last night and I don't know why. Oh shit, he can do day drinking? This game is epic. Is he just drinking straight vodka? Wait, that helped his mental... He's kind of drunk though. Can he drink more? What happens if he gets like super sloshed? More, 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 more. Shot, 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 shot. Oh. Milk and alcohol. Oh my. God. Maybe this will help his mental elf. I'm just gonna make him keep drinking milk over and over. Again, Lucas. Keep drinking the milk. Imagine all that vodka and milk sloshing around in his tum tum. Oh, no, I'm going c c crazy. I need to drink milk now. Wait, the water will help. I forgot to drink it before. Leave the fridge open all day, then drink the milk. Oh. Is there even a mechanic like that in a game this old? Wait, I wonder if there's anything on the answering machine. Yesterday, at 7.30 p.m. Ah, uh, don't listen to it! Lucas, it's Tiffany. Tiffany? I thought maybe I'd pop over tomorrow night after I leave the hospital and pick up a few things. Well, call me back. Okay, Tiffany. This morning, at 7.52 a.m. Hey, did you like, murder that guy in the bathroom? It's Marcus. I'm calling because tomorrow is the 10th anniversary of the accident, and I thought... Well, maybe you might want to go together this time. Anyway, give me a call. Goodbye. The accident? Oh, no, no, no. He's having psychosis again. Oh, fuck. Bro, let's go on to his bedroom. Why don't we change the sheets? That should help my migraine. Notice reads... Don't take with alcohol. Uh. And that's the end of my story. I mixed alcohol and medication and I lost consciousness. <laughs> Suicide or accident, what's the difference? <laughs> I'll never know what happened to me in that dark before Baker's night. Because in the eyes of the world, I was just a murderer. Well, it looks like I mixed medication and alcohol and I killed myself. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> Well, guess that's how my story ends. Accidentally took alcohol and sleeping pills. Silly me. Wait! Now I can do it right. Now I can just drink the... Drink milk? Milk, milk, lemonade. Round the corner fudge is made. Open the fridge, Lucas. Just 
stop fucking around and drink the milk. Now. And that's how my story ends. <laughs> Bro, I'm gonna die one day and that's, that's gonna flash through my mind. Like, I'm gonna imagine it like it's a scene from this game where you get a game over. Well, looks like I accidentally uh, drove into the wrong side of the traffic. That's how my story ends. Well, looks like I fell into this industrial hydraulic press machine. Okay, he's got plus five to his mental elf. Now, let's go. You think he can pee again and help his mental? After drinking? And that's how my story ends. Hey, you're listening to KWN605, and it's now time for the weather flash with Cindy. Hi, Cindy. A dead body was discovered last night in a bathroom. Today is dressed very warmly before setting foot outside. It was extremely cold last night, and in some places the snow has turned into sheets of... He didn't care to listen to that. Take that your should medication. help my migraine. Notice. Dress warmly. Don't take with alcohol. Snow is so Reddit core. Getting excited for like crystallized cold water falling on you, it's so fucking cringe. What, do you want a, a snow Funko Pop now? Oh no, what if he looks at this picture of his wife and his mental goes down? Let's go on the computer and do like fun stuff instead of looking at your dead wife. Whoa, is this what computers in the future look like? Oh my god, he would have like a, a fucking plane as his background. That is so like dude core. Video games notch up new victims. Several dozen violent video games were found in the room of the two adolescent killers. What? I feel like this is saying something, but I don't know what. A mass of cold air coming down from Canada will cause a new drop in temperature all over the country. So, uh, bad news for people running away after killing someone in a diner bathroom. It's gonna be chilly out there while you're on the run. Pakistan, the ultimatum ends today. <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck? <laughs> Is this like real news? <laughs> From 2005? What's in your inbox, Lucas? Oh, nothing, huh? Interesting. Is this what David Cage thought computers would look like in the future? Just hologram screens? Is this pre or post 9-11? I feel like this might take place in an alternate history. My parents, Marcus and me, before no. the accident. No, the accident! Marcus? Was Marcus his brother? Wait, so he doesn't have a dead wife. It's dead parents. So that, that fucks you up in a different kind of way. That's like early fucked upness. It's like pre ordering trauma. Why don't you change your clothes a bit, Lucas? Oh, uh, why did the camera turn away? He just. <laughs> Bro, he's like a cartoon character and just has this exact same outfit over and over in his closet. Hmm, I think I'll wear this one today. Here we go, Lucas. Maybe it'll get nice and warm in here for you. What's this newspaper on the floor, Lucas? This is what it's like to be really depressed. Massacre in East End oh. Restaurant. An especially oh. horrible murder was committed last oh. night in the restroom of a local oh. restaurant. The killer is a man in put the down, Put it down, put it down. Put it down, put it down. The killer is a man in his 30s and really ugly and stupid, and he probably smelled so bad. Oh, why don't we listen to some music? He has a book on Kung Fu? Wait. They just have real music here? Mm -hmm. 
Okay, put on your favorite CD and listen to it, Lucas. Do you think this will help his mental health? Yeah, Lucas, shut all the windows. Time to listen to Theory of a Dead Man and just fucking rock out and punch this thing. When you're like really depressed and trying to like get the will to get out of bed in the morning and just like take care of yourself, it helps to imagine that you're a video game character like Lucas. Adulting can be hard sometimes, but don't worry. I want to take a piss while listening to Theory of a Dead Man. Wait, will this give him plus five? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh. Oh, I see. Wash your face, Lucas. That always helps. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a new day. Nice and clean and fresh and ready to go. Yeah, he gets minus five if it splits in two. My PB split in two and it hurt really bad. Mom, help me! I made you do those things. <laughs> do you think David Cage is a fan of this band, or did they just like randomly choose it? Because it was cheap to get the rights for it. Follow me! I'm just gonna leave the radio playing. Fuck, bro, the camera is so fucked sometimes. <laughs> It makes you just run into a wall over and over. <laughs> Cage loves the divorce dad rock. Lucas Kane, the park. Carla Valenti, the poop. Can I play both of them or do I have to choose? Like, is this just choosing who I do first? What should we do? You choose? Oh my god. I want to I see what Lucas is up to in the park. I'm, I'm intrigued. Like, what's going on with him? Kids, we were inseparable. He's the you one play the other after? after okay, we'll go again. Died. Is this like we Shenmue where there's like real time? He became a priest. But he's still the only person I really trust. The only one who might believe that I had nothing to do with all this mess. Father, forgive me. I went pee pee and I didn't wash my hands. Is he cold? Uh... Oh, look at the kids playing in the park. They look so innocent and naive. Wait, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanna see it. I just wanna see if there's subtitles. Okay, graphic little level medium. Okay, it controls. Audio? Is there really no subtitles? Uh... Control type. <laughs> Happy to see you. I missed you. It's been a while. Two Wait. years. So tell me what's happened. It's Lucas. helping his mental health. I've killed a man, Marcus. It happened in a restaurant last night. It's like I was possessed in a sort of trance, like I was a puppet on a string. I saw what I was doing, but I was powerless to stop it. It was like I was in a video My game. God. I can't believe this, Lucas. Tell me that it wasn't you. You're not capable of something like that. <laughs> you went to this restaurant alone? Yeah. Tiffany and I... Oh, come on, bro. For real? Come on. I try to get out of the apartment as much as possible. It's just so empty there without her. You know. Tiffany? And there's this, too. You cut your wrists? Before the murder, I, I carved these symbols on my arms with a knife. What? I don't know if they mean anything. What symbols? You say that you were in a sort of a trance. But what do you mean by that? Are you talking about magic? Or sorcery? Or something like that? <laughs> Marcus, I don't have Is an Is he talking about trance music? I'm just telling or was you it like happened, that's all. <laughs> I'm only certain about one thing. I'm not the one who really killed that man. He looks like an Oblivion NPC. Had you been drinking? Or taking drugs? You know that I don't do that, Marcus. While I was doing this horrible thing, I saw something, or or rather someone. Was what? somebody else there with you? 
No, it was, it was like a sort of vision. I saw a man in the middle of hundreds of candles, and, and there was this little girl. You saw a little girl? She Why was the priest alone, asking about that? Lost. She, she asked me to help her. What happened to me, Marcus? What am I supposed to do now? You know me better than anyone, Marcus. Help me. Listen, Lucas, I... I'm a bit lost here. Lucas. This whole story is just so bizarre. Lucas, this is a crazy. Maybe you need some professional help. Most cases of possession are known to actually stem from psychiatric problems. Marcus, I don't have a psychiatric problem. I'm not <laughs> crazy. I am a priest, Lucas. The fact that you have taken a life is a very serious matter. Well, you're not supposed I to tell me. I told you me. that it wasn't me, Marcus. All these years and nothing's changed. You still never listen to me. Lucas, don't ask Come me on, to make please, a choice between a my faith and my brother. I'm not a murderer, Marcus. You're the only person I can trust. I'm just asking you to believe me. What if he Very actually well. didn't do it and just found I'll like someone else's dead body? I can for you, but I can't do anything that goes against my beliefs. Like he was already Look, dead. I, I need to get some answers. I'll, I'll call you. Here. You need this more than I do. Marcus, <laughs> you know that I don't believe in all that. Take it. Take it, Lucas. <gasps> I have another life! Christ is watching over me now. Thank you, Marcus. Marcus and Lucas, those are very biblical sounding names. <gasps> the crow again! Will die. Save the if child. Do something. The cop will recognize me. He said, "Do do." What am I gonna do? Save the child. Save the child, Marcus. Come on, Marcus, go. He's not gonna recognize you. You're gonna be all wet. You're gonna be all, all wet and cold. Bro, this is actually so hard. He He's lost consciousness. Come on, Marcus, you can Quick. do it. I've got to go back up before I run out of air. Hard as fuck. You have to click so fast. <laughs> Do you hear how fucking fast I'm going on the fucking I saved him. I saved the day. Uh, do melt the melt. Uh, not in a weird way though. CBR. CBR. One, two, three. Present. One, two, three. One, two, two three. One, Great, two, two three. One, Great, two, two three. three. Great, One, two, two, three. I saved the day with a QTE. And I helped my two, mental four. elf. Kid just fell into the water. Send an ambulance right away. Man, what courage. The kid would have died. That guy's a hero. He yeah, I saved the day. Water to save the kid. I actually the kid saved the day. would have made it out of there without him. Yeah, and the I did CPR. recognized me. We both knew it. But it's hard what do you to mean? say why he didn't turn me in. But he never saw you. Maybe he decided I was even. I had taken a life and given one back. What the? He, no, he never Nothing fucking really saw you because I, I ran out of the. For murder by the police. But when I left that park, I knew I could look myself in the mirror again without cringing. <laughs> I've got this really bad habit for a cop. Once I start working on a case, it can't be I him. Can't the suspect wasn't else. wet and cold. <laughs> I'm exhausted. I haven't gotten a wink of sleep all night. <laughs> Something's bothering me about this murder, but I just can't seem to put my finger on what it is. All right, where's the nearest bathroom? I want to see Carla piss too. Every character Hi, in this Carla. game needs to piss. 
How are you doing today? Hey. Hi, Doug. Not hey, Doug. Bad. Is Tyler here yet? No, not that I know of. So, ready for that big retirement? What is the uh, accent? Working on it. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll check in. Wait, who's this guy? Just sitting by his lonesome. This really... Does this really take place in the future? Or is this just like alternate universe 2005? Where everything is like a little advanced. I went through the metal detectors. I always get so nervous when I have to do that because I always get like a paranoia that what if they think I have something when I don't? Like when you're at the airport. Yes. Where's Tyler? Hello, yeah, Inspector. I found out I'm actually a robot and I didn't know this whole time. I thought I was... I thought I was a real human, but it turns out I'm a cyborg and they find out that way and Hi, then they Carla, all shoot me. Wait, who said hi? Hey there, Philip. How's it going? Carla need coffee. Carla, Carla has a fuck crustable of a headache right now and she needs drinking now. Mmm, nom 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 nom. I got this new, like, lotion for my Patrick Bateman skincare type of shit that I do. Cause I like, I like, I like taking care of my, my skin on my face. And it's like a vitamin C serum. Which is like, it's Tyler actually really nice. Tyler is still not here. I better try to give him a ring. Oh yeah, let's call Tyler. Tyler, come in! Stop playing Xbox. I need Dwinky. It's like... It's supposed to be really good for... I don't know, like, I rejuvenating your flesh. Especially in the winter, if hey, your Carl, skin gets really dry and crusty. Which mine me? does. I've been waiting six months for it now. Stop Can't yammering! Free. Talk to him about it. He's been avoiding me like the plague. Plus, you know, you're the only one he listens to. Who? Catch you later, Jeffrey. Jeffrey? What kind of cop looks like this? He looks like he's just like... from Oregon. You know? He does not look like a cop at all. Maybe he's... maybe that's his character. He's like a rebellious kind of cop. Like a cool cop. I'm a cool cop. I don't shoot people without asking first. Asking nicely. With Riz. <laughs> I'm a cop with Riz. I'm gonna Riz you up. And then I'm gonna tase you. I need to go into my office now. May I have permission to shoot you, please? May I have permission to use force? Hi, Carla. Hi, Ooh. Garrett. Garrett! Oh, wait, Carla. Where's Frank? I got some results back on the tests we did for that restaurant murder. Me, 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 as soon as Tyler gets here, we'll come and see you. <laughs> okay, I'll be at my desk all morning. I got my dog with the test. <laughs> Fuck you, Garrett. Go to hell. I like her turtleneck. It's kind of a moment. She's kind of mothering right now. She's conti. It's a real serve. <gasps> she has a basketball hoop in her office? Wait, that's probably not hers because she's a stuck-up bitch. Which I, I don't think is a bad thing. Drink some water, Carla. You need it. Oh yeah, I was saying I use this like vitamin C lotion on my face. Because in the winter, my skin gets really dry. Because it's super dry here. And it smells like potatoes for some reason. Like french fries. I don't really like it. <laughs> You'd think like a vitamin C lotion would kind of smell citrusy. But no, pure vitamin C doesn't, uh, doesn't smell like an orange. It just smells like shit. It smells really weird, but... Oh, she has a yo-yo? completely idiotic, but it helps me think. She's gonna stim. Stim, Carla, stim! Oh, fuck. Oh, I fucked it up. Oh, man. I'm sorry, Carla. That was embarrassing. C stands for citrus. Yes. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Cat in the cradle. Do the cat in the cradle. Walk the dog. Can you guys do yo-yo tricks? I've always wanted to learn how to do some. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. I have to stim. Hold on, guys. 
you're like in a it's like a police drama <laughs> and there's one cop that's like <laughs> guys i have to stem to think what what is she doing what why is she playing with that fidget spinner doesn't she know we have to solve this case? Why is she wasting time? Shh. No. Let her stem. It's probably what L from Death Note did. Oh, fuck. <gasps> ah, I fucked it up again. I'm a detective. I'm a detective. Down. 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 Um, well, oh my god, Carla. Carla, I didn't know you were chill like that. That was cool. Oh, fuck. I, I somehow fucked it up. Do you get an achievement if you manage to do it, like, perfectly? Or does this, does this just go forever? Can you just do it infinitely? I really love the extended yo-yo scene in... Fahrenheit Indigo Prophecy. Wait. Is it called Indigo Prophecy because he's an indigo child? Do you guys know what indigo children are? Are you an indigo child by any chance? It's called Tyler. It's a special kind of child that is in tune with the spiritual world. Maybe he's in tune with the spiritual world because he's an indigo child. Yeah. Know what time it is? Why does he have a, oh, a bear rug? Get a move on. The waitress is coming this morning to flesh out the composite on the killer. I'm on my way. Is that his girlfriend? Well, she's wearing his jersey, I think. That's cute. Wait, let's switch to him. We have to get him ready for work. Come on, Tyler, get up! Wake up, Tyler! You had to go to work. Why does this lava lamp look like it has a, a pine cone in it? Mm, sorry, babe, but I really gotta go. I'll make some coffee. Okay, I'll grab a shower, get dressed, and then I'm out of here. Oh, uh, sorry, babe, I have to go work at the police force. <laughs> Fuck, I gotta get out of here, I gotta get out of here. <laughs> I wanna watch her sleep. Man. I love watching her when she's sleeping. <laughs> I've known her for two years now. She still rocks my world the way she did the first time I ever saw her. Wait, that's actually so sweet. Wait, kiss her, kiss her. Oh. I thought you were in a hurry. Uh. Hey, I always got two minutes for you, babe. Only two minutes? Maybe three this time. <laughs> Wait, t Tyler, you have to get... Tyler, come on, get ready for work. Tyler? Uh... Bro, the, pic is, the picture of his parents are watching. What? Why is the camera shaking like that? Is Is there gonna be a, a QTE to uh, pull out? Okay, it's been about a minute. Uh, all right, let's see what Carla's up to. Do -do. <laughs> oh, sweet. Time to do some fucking yo yo tricks. Let's fucking go. Oh, shit. Oh, darn it. Oh, man. Fumbled again. We'll get him next time. Okay. You have to go to work! 
か<笑>タイラー hates it when anyone touches his stuff Does he? <laughs> Wait, can she shoot hoop? Come on, Carla. Stop being such a stick in the mud and shoot hoop. Where's the... Where's the bee ball? There's a basketball hoop, but no bee ball? Where's she keeping that thing? Oh, 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 oh. Tyler still hasn't gotten rid of this basketball. Funny, I thought I'd been pretty clear. What if you can just keep switching to that throughout the rest of the game? Like, you're playing as Lucas and he's like, I can't believe it. I, I took another human life. I, I'm a monster. What have I done? And you switch and it's like... <laughs> wow, thank you for saving my son when he fell into the ice. You're a hero. He could have been dead for sure. Oh, it's, it's no danger to me. <laughs> How long is this fucking gonna take? Does it just play on loop? Tyler is still not here. Where is I he? Try and give him a ring. Oh no, don't please don't ring him. Please don't ring him, Carla. Not now. Ooh. Come on, Tyler. Are you gonna come to work or what? Uh, 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 uh! <laughs> Nobody here. What the fuck is everybody? You think people t take the job seriously at the police station, but they just don't give a fuck. Uh, Carla? Uh... Uh, guys? Car Carla? Saves it auto saves right <laughs> Bro, I thought something was wrong as soon as I went up to the door and it was just like clipping into darkness. <laughs> Tyler Come on, Tyler, you should have come to work. It's kinda it's kinda sweet. It's a sweet little love story. <laughs> He's gonna die, isn't he? Okay, please, please, please. Tyler's apartment. Wait. Wait, can I look at my sleeping wife again? Or his sleeping wife? Wait, Ty Tyler? Ty Ty Tyler? <laughs> Man. I love watching her when she's sleeping. I'm really confused by the lava lamp. What is that supposed to be? My world the way she did the first time I ever saw her. You really walk my world. What? A statuette of socks. One of the characters in my favorite video game. He does like video games. Wait, okay. Give her a smooch. I thought you were in a hurry. Why was she? Hey, did she not I wash her face last night? For you, babe. Only two minutes. Please don't crash the game again, Tyler. All oh, right. Uh, I better give him a wing. Where the fuck is Tyler? Oh no. Yeah, Carla. I'm on my way. Uh, yeah, I know. No, I... No, I, I just had a little problem, so I... Yeah. Okay, okay, I'm right there. A little problem?
Oh no. She ruined their morning. Whew, girl. Okay, this time I really am out of here. <laughs> Why is he sitting like that? <laughs> okay, wait. <laughs> uh, never mind. <laughs> Why is there a pine cone in the lava lamp? <laughs> he he really does have a pretty swanky room. What does that say? Hey, you're a good looking guy, you know that? Is this what it's like to be a, a guy? I love how all the models in this game just like have textures. <laughs> Me when I play every game. <laughs> no, 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 no. I know, no shit. I mean, I, I, you know what I mean? Like they, all the models in this game for like you, know, like his chest and like his abs and shit are just like a like a, a flat picture, just like printed onto the model. Take a shower, Tyler. You gotta get to work. Come on. Uh... Why is this music playing again? Bro, what the fuck is up with his GF? It's like... Is two minutes not enough? She says she's gonna go take a shit in the toilet. Oh yeah, baby, I love it when you take a shit while I'm taking a shower and the shower steam kinda... kinda mixes with the shit smell, makes it even more pungent. Oh yeah. All the, the shit particles just kind of get tied up and all the steam and it just kind of wafts into... Oh, yeah. Wait, bro. You have to take a piss. Always pee after you do the deed. You don't want to get a UTI, Tyler. Come on. Police officers don't get UTIs. Ew, why does he have a rug right under his toilet? You'd think, like, a woman's touch would help this man, but I don't think it is. He's too busy, like, schlobbing on his knob. Hey, baby girl. Oh, Sam looks like she's sulking. And I know what's bothering her. Wait, what? Because you got caught in the middle of doing intimacy things? Do you want some coffee, Sam? Go back to bed, Sam. You're going to catch a death of cold like that. I'm not cold. What? What's oh, the matter? Look, Sam, please don't start. I got no intention of dying today. I'm sick of living in fear like this. Aww. Every morning, I'm, I'm terrified that something's going to happen to you. Oh, be understanding. Don't be a dick. Feel, Sam. There's a lot of violence out there. But if nobody does anything, it's all gonna go to shit. We're gonna have kids someday. I wanna leave them a world that's a little better than the one we got now. But why does it have to be you who's out there risking his life, Tyler? Why couldn't we just go to Florida and work with my family and live a normal life like Florida everybody else? Florida sucks, Sam! Florida's a why fucking shithole! Why do I have to wonder if you're gonna die every day? Uh... I'm not ready for a normal life yet, Sam. Right now, I belong here. You need to try to accept me for what I am and what I choose to do. Oh no, they're gonna have an argument before he goes to work and she's gonna be at home, like, still, like, ruminating over the argument and feeling bad about it all day until he gets back from work! What have you done, Tyler, you stupid bitch? Make her... make her a sandwich. Make her a cereal. Why is there just... Why is there alcohol in the freezer next to frozen pizzas? Are they making a slushy? Come on. He needs to fix his posture. Put some clothes on, Tyler. You need to go into the office. Here you go, Sam. I'll put on your favorite music. Boom, 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 boom. What? <laughs> Oh, 
bro, come on. Bro. <laughs> Why is he like a, a disco man from the 70s? You wanna dance? Hey, what, if, what if I can cheer her up by dancing with her? Or dancing for her? Do a little jig. Okay, where are your clothes, Tyler? What should we wear today? To the radio. <laughs> oh, he's got his favorite little fleece outfit on. It's like blue camouflage. He looks like a snowboarder. <laughs> he looks like a character from SSX Tricky. <laughs> Wait, what? If, uh, maybe uh, brush your teeth? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Looking good, Tyler. David Cage really is like the Tommy Wiseau of video games. Just like this foreign guy that is obsessed with America and just doesn't really quite grasp American culture. Why can't he keep talking to her? Okay, put your jacket on. He better kiss her goodbye. Don't leave her hanging, Tyler. Come on, she's looking at you expectantly! <gasps> okay! This could be the last time. Cause what if you die? I love you, Tyler. <laughs> Bro, what if she dies? And he he's like sworn to vengeance. Sam, I promise I'm not going to die at work today. Okay. Yeah, why didn't he say it back? There was there was no QTE to say I love you back when she said I love you. What the fuck? Bad boyfriend QTE. Bad boyfriend QTE. Hi, Tyler. Oh, uh, Carl is looking for you. Oh. Yeah, I know. So, you ready for retirement, man? Yeah, <laughs> I'm working on it. Is that his whole character? Is this the guy who's working on being retired? Yeah, when are you gonna retire? I'm I'm fucking Hi, sick of seeing hey, you at work. What's up? Retire What's already. Tyler? More people said hello to him when he came into the office versus Carla, and I think that's a commentary on women in the workplace. The only person who said hello to Carla was like the creepy Garrett guy. Hey Tyler, what do you know? Just the guy I was looking for. Oh, oh shit. Ah, shit. You remember that hundred bucks I loaned you about six months ago? I'd really like for you to get that back to me as soon as possible. Like maybe now, for example? Uh, charity. Jeffrey, I'm gonna be honest with you, man. I got no more money. I gave it all to charity in yeah. an effort to make the world a better place for you and for me. That's real funny, Tyler. Now give me my hundred bucks before I get really pissed. But the orphans need it. Yo, let me make you a deal. I'll play you a game of b-ball for your hundred bucks. B-ball? If you win, I'll give you two hundred bucks right then. But if you lose, we cool. You'll give me two hundred bucks if I win. You'll you give me two hundred bucks. All right, you're on. But We're gonna play b-ball. But don't even think about not paying me if you lose, because that... Don't worry, Jeffrey. I'll come by and see this you when I get five This guy's got gold, minutes. like, 24 karat ass rings on his hands. He doesn't need $200. Fuck you. Fuck out of here. Forget about it. Is there gonna be a b-ball minigame? I kind of like the buddy cop thing that's going on in this game so far. The waitress hasn't come in yet? She won't be long. It's kind of like rush Gannon hour. The lab results. And instead of an Asian man, it's right, a really bitchy woman. Okay, see you in a minute. Which is actually pretty, it works pretty well. If he... Oh my god, if he starts coming on to Carlo, 
When he has Sam, I'm gonna fucking kill him. I'm gonna actually fail a QTE and get him hit by a car and die. Okay, we need to practice the b-ball so we can get our $200. Oh, he's doing tricks. I wonder if he can do yo-yo tricks too. What the fuck was that? Uh, maybe if I interact with a hoop. Are you are you gonna shoot? Are you gonna shoot it in a hoop? He shoots. He scores. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Throw it behind your back, like do a trick shot. Round the world, all round the world. He hates basketball. What happened, Tyler? He can't even interact with the yo-yo. Yo-yos are for girls. Yeah, maybe there's a hidden prompt. <laughs> Why is he typing like that? Let's go on the web. Life sentences for 200 peer-to-peer -peer pirates? Ooh. I'm buying Winrar tonight. Cold wave makes new victims. China preoccupied by the situation in Pakistan. Who wrote all these fake news articles? Database? Can I type something in? Wait, this menu, I haven't seen it yet. I'm 100% neutral. And I'm pretty cool. Boop. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, gotta hang up your jacket. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's rude to wear your coat indoors. Is this Carla's desk right here? What if you just like start smelling her seat? Some water, Tyler. Yeah, what if we can ball now that we took our jacket off? Yenos. Hello. I'm Yenos. Ow! I hit my fucking tooth on my microphone. My teeth are so fucking big. I don't know about his weird, like, blue camouflage shirt. It's kind of... It's a choice, for sure. It's rude to wear your coat indoors? Yeah, isn't it? Isn't it rude to, like, wear coats and hats indoors? Yeah, it's very Y2K kind of fashion. Carla! So, what do you want to start with? Uh, the knife. What did you find on the knife? Got some good prints off it. They matched those found on the fork and glass at the suspect's table. So, the murderer was definitely Why is at he that so table. zesty? Anything on the blade? I'm getting to that. We definitely had blood from the victim. Are you British? But yeah. But the weird thing is, we also found blood from the killer. I've been living in America so long that I did just kind of lost my accent, though. Cloth from the fence. It was soaked in the victim's blood. Otherwise, it was just a fairly common piece of cloth. Nothing really special about it. And, um... Uh, my family is actually, uh... What about the pool of blood in the stall? You're not gonna believe related this. Related to... The blood Prince wasn't Harry. from the victim. It was from the killer. What was he doing bleeding in the stall? I have absolutely no idea. The Were book. there any prints on the book that was under the table? Yep. And uh. they matched the ones on the fork and the glass. Interesting. So it was definitely his book. It looked like a fairly old book. Maybe we can get some more stuff out of it. Did you find anything on the coffee cup? Yeah, get stuff the out of it. The we found belonged to the waitress. That's impossible, man. That cup was half empty. Somebody must have drank it. So it was cup. It was. It was. It was, it was half I don't full. Have any explanation for the blood in the stall. The victim could have wounded the killer during a struggle, but it doesn't make sense that it would be in the stall. It's as though the killer wounded himself. Hey, why not? You get clumsy fools in every other profession. Why not killers? That's kind of a flimsy explanation, Gary. <laughs> oh no, this is so embarrassing! Oh, 
I do the testing, you figure out the reason I feel why. so bad for Lucas. Thanks for your help, Garrett. See you later. He's the worst killer ever. Wait. So, what do we do now? You go take Something's care of the Something's bothering me. I'm gonna go check with the coroner and see if he got anything from the body. Okay. Catch you later. Can we do an Before autopsy? Before I go see the coroner, I'm just gonna drop by my desk and check my email. Bro, this is actually, like, my inner monologue every day. You need some coffee, are we, Tyler? Hi, Carla. Hey. What's up? Alright, I'm just gonna go check my emails now. Hopefully the game doesn't crash. During a 10 minute long sex scene again. What if the murderer was a complete fucking dumbass with no life? What if the murderer listened to Theory of a Dead Man? And played electric guitar? My emails. Valium? Cheaper Valium? Is this like spam or does she need Valium? Hi Carla, I'm sorry I wasn't able to give you any news for a while. I've been very busy with my job. I'll drop by your place as soon as I can to tell you about my latest adventures. Lots of kisses, Tommy. It's all happened before. Kirsten. Kirsten. What's that supposed to mean? From an unknown sender, subject none. Who got my email and sent such a thing? Alright, I'm gonna go to, uh... Pissy... Paradise.com Pissymassage.com Wait, who should we play as? Lucas Kane? Should, should we go to the mortuary? Or should we go to the police station as Tyler? What do we do? What do we do? Ah, I don't know! I don't know what to do! Time is ticking. Lucas? You guys want more Lucas? <laughs> oh no, what's happening? Is this where he works? Or did he just have to go to the bank for some reason? I was burning with fever. I was shaking all over. I was the wearing a gay was little back sweater. Drilling holes into my brain. And to top it off, I couldn't keep any food down. My body seemed to be fighting against something, but I still didn't know what. Maybe you're pregnant, Lucas. The Pregnant Murderer by David Cage. Oh, I'm so pregnant. I'm gonna have to figure out how to give birth. I need to do my breathing exercises. <clears throat> The baby's head won't come out. Gonna have to find another way. Hmm. Hmm. It's locked. I have to do a C-section. Hmm. I need the tools for the C-section. Maybe they were in the garage. Hmm. Garage door is locked. Gonna have to find another way. Why are the stalls so small? Have you ever been in a situation where you're like, Oh, I'll use the... There's the only stall that's open is the, the handicap stall and you're like, oh god, I have to go so bad. Oh, I'll just use this one. Uh, what, are, what are the chances, right? What are the chances? And then like someone knocks on it and you're like... Gotta just live my life no matter what. Don't raise any suspicions. And then just like Despite walk out and act like you're like, you can barely to to walk. Work as though nothing had happened. Are you so good at being a point and click adventure narrator? Because that's my life. When you're neurodivergent, you live your life like a point and click adventure narrator. This is such a strange vision of the future. It's closed. I've got no business here. <laughs> Me when I try to go into my sister's bedroom to read her diary. Hey Lucas, I think I've got a virus. Can you have a look during the day? Uh, sure. Oh god, this guy has to work in a fucking office. No wonder why he's going crazy. Wait, who said that? Who needs I've help? I've got nothing to say to him. I hate that guy. He stole my lunch out of the office with a joiter. In the break room. He's working. Better leave him alone. 
This guy is looking at porno. Have you seen the time, Mr. Kane? I'll have to inform the management. What? Are you a snitch? Was he was he being a fucking hall monitor? Wait, where's Lucas's desk? Where's where's Lucas's place in the world? Lucas has to find his place in the world. Maybe it's over here where the red dot is. I'm in charge of computer maintenance <gasps> in the Nacer and it's Jones snowing. Bank. I share my office with Warren. Do you know what time it is? What's oh, fuck you? you. I had a little problem on the way back in. I had to go back home and change my clothes. You shit yourself again, didn't you, Lucas? Yeah. Next time, I'll help you clean up. <laughs> Let's take a set. Get ready. Wait, uh, QTE for operating a pooter? I'm a that fucking computer so genius, apparently. What'd you say? The fuck did you say to me, Warren? What? You were saying something? No, I didn't say anything. Mm -hmm. Are you sure you're Stupid all right, Lucas? Boy. I... What was that? I heard something as though I could read his mind. May Bro, maybe I'm on to something. Maybe he can like tap into something that other people can't and he's he's like he's like confusing it and thinking he's going crazy. Tiffany and I, but he's not. not. Two years ago, I guess. He saw the vision of the murderer. Been able to throw it away yet. He didn't actually kill the guy. It was that guy in the raincoat with the candles. And he was seeing that as he came across the body. He's not the guy who's like, oh, yeah. Hello, Lucas. Oh, hello, Tiffany. Bro. I left a message on your machine Okay, what if she's in the mortuary? Um, I'd like and they're to like, and that's strange. This guy tonight. died actually like a day Can ago. Come over uh, yes. I should be back home around 8 o'clock tonight. Okay, it won't take too long. Are you doing okay, Lucas? I gotta let you go. I'm doing a thing here. Bye. <laughs> the camera switches to this computer and he's like playing cookie clicker. <laughs> Go QT. Ah! Okay. Great. Look out, the cop. Huh? Lucas, is there a problem? No, I, I, I just thought. What the fuck? It seemed so real. I saw that coffee cup fall. Did it not fall yet? Lucas? You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm fine. This is me every day that I had to play World of Warcraft. Oh, oh no, I'm gonna... Oh, my coffee! Wait a minute. Mm. Hello? Hello? Yes, sir. We'll get on that right away. <laughs> Station 62 is down. He sounds I'll like go. such a nerd. <laughs> Hello? Oh, forget it. I'll, I'll handle it. Oh no, my coffee. You say. <laughs> oh, dude. <It> <laughs> oh. Just like I'd seen it. Such a mess. Apartment. Is it possible that I can really see things before they happen? Maybe, Lucas. This is what it's like to do work at a job. <gasps> I got another life! It pays to do some, uh... Fiddling around this stuff. <laughs> do you think he could have prevented 9-11? I feel like this actually does take place in, like, an alternate history. Just based on, like, the news articles and shit. Oh man, I can't get any work done. I'm too restless. Mm, I can't pay attention. I wish I had a yo-yo so I could stem. Snowing again. And the weather forecast predicts another drop in temperature over the next few days. Oh. Huh. Yeah, what if the, the strange blizzard weather events are tied to his prophecies? Like his mind powers? 
He's in tap with something. He, he's tapped into something. He's tapped in. What does that mean, tap in? Why wouldn't sweetie, the rapper Saweetie mean when she said tap in? Like tap, tap, tap in. Tap, tap, tap in. What does that mean? Was she talking about indigo children? Like how they're tapped in to like... A, a, the spiritual realm? Does Saweetie know something that we don't? Ah! Sweetie! The bug people! What the fuck was that? Oh. oh, what the fuck? What was that? <gasps> Ew, gross, 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 gross. What the fuck is that? What are, why are the, what are, why are, what are the bugs doing in the office? They're, they're not even working. They don't even have a job. <gasps> Move! Get out of the way! Lucas! Duh! Uh, down, down, left, up, left, down! <laughs> Why is he running away like a girl? <laughs> oh my god, they're so scary! So oh, gross! <laughs> Oh my god. Are you guys seeing this shit? What the fuck? I am not working overtime tonight. This this sucks. God, I should have called him. <laughs> the fucking horror music. Ah! Oh, he's gonna he's gonna get strangled. <laughs> uh. Lucas, no! So, I guess that's how my story ends. Got strangled to death by a giant bug monster. <laughs> ah! Ah! Oh! What if the bug starts like jerking him off and he's like, Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> oh in that case. <laughs> They just want friends. They're just misunderstood. <laughs> no! no. Ah! Come on! Ah! God, that's actually so hard. What the fuck? Ah! Bob and weave. Come on, Lucas. If you can kill a man, you can escape a giant bug monster. Ooh, it shaked his little ass. Please come join us. Oh, Jesus! Oh, thank you for the raid! Plague of Gripes! I'm playing a cinematic masterpiece! <laughs> right now, our protagonist, Lucas, is being chased by giant bug monsters at his place of work. What is going to happen next? Oh! Is it over for Lucas? We'll have to see. Think quick, Lucas! Use the fire extinguisher! They hate it! They hate the fire extinguisher! Oh! Wait, no, they actually like it. Spray us more, Lucas! We want to eat the fire extinguisher! Oh! These bugs got really fat asses! The bugs have a gat! Did anybody else, did, did anybody else notice that the bugs kind of have a gat? <laughs> no, he's just... He just played it like a fucking Mario game. He just went like... Boing, boing. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck is this kid to eat? That's actually impossible. Are you fucking kidding me? How am I... Uh, how am I supposed to uh, do that? So there's fucking giant bugs everywhere. Two faces of the same serpent. One in our world. The other in the other world. Yo... Do his co-workers see this? Is he just like running around the office going like... Ah! 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 No! No! Stop! Please! No! No! Lucas? Lucas, what happened? Oh you hear me? no, Are you this is right? actually so embarrassing. Hey, He's never gonna live this one down. Yourself. You're bleeding. Oh no. All I, his co-workers uh, gonna think he's weird. Go. 
I didn't have the slightest idea what had happened. The one thing I do know, those things almost killed me. Wait, so did he actually grab the fire extinguisher IRL and start spraying his co-workers with it? Because <laughs> he thought they were giant bugs? Oh god, I'm cringing. This guy is so awkward. Let's go to Carla at the mortuary. I wanna... I wanna see if my theory is right. They're like doing an autopsy on him and they're like, strange. The time he deceased was... Well before the suspect ran away. By hours at least. I don't think Lucas did it. I think he saw who really did it and thought that he did it. Okay, we're going to get started. Uh, if you prefer, you can wait outside. I'd rather stay here if you don't mind. I've studied some medicine. I've seen dead bodies. I want to oh. see more dead bodies. I want to watch you carve As into you it. I kind of like it. Oh. No apparent hematoma on the body. Oh, no, a cutie effort. Two broken fingernails on the right hand. Okay. Great. He didn't see the murderer until the last moment. He didn't have time to struggle. Interesting. Large hematoma on the back of the cranium. Ew. Uh, mm, Sounds nasty. Fracture of the occipital bone. He cracked his head when he fell. Abnormal what a loser. Dilation in um, both pupils. Oh, ah, fuck. I failed it. I, I was I was getting too immersed into the cut Three cutscene. knife wounds between the third and fifth ribs in the proximity of the heart. Mm. Uh, the blade was driven in deeply. Oh, I see. Indubitably. Why does he have to be so snarky about right. it? Great. The murderer was left handed. One stab. Left handed people are psychopaths. The, and the other two cut the left and right coronary arteries. They oh, really didn't have a chance. The blade slipped right through the ribs to cut the arteries. Ugh. Uh, Do you think the killer had some knowledge of anatomy? <laughs> but I doubt that someone that was such a dumb question. Oh my god. How did how did the killer know that if he stabbed someone in the heart that it would kill them? It's kind of weird, don't you think? Do you think it was just by chance? Hmm. Difficult to say. The chances of cutting all three main arteries to the heart with three lucky stabs are fairly small, but um, it's not impossible. Bro, I think this guy I got married. I saw a case like this once before. It was a while back now, in the nineties. With think. a knife. Exactly the same. Three stabs around the heart, each one cutting a main artery. It really mm. struck me at the time. I wondered how such a thing were possible. It was the, um, what was that name again? Karsten or Kirsten, something like that. Kirsten. Kirsten. Yes, that's it, Kirsten. That's what the, the email you know said. About that case? Not yet. I'm sure as hell gonna find out. Why is Carla always smirking, like, seductively? Come Even in. when she's uh, hello, in front of a dead hello, body. Mrs. Morrison. Uh, thanks for taking the trouble to come down. Uh, please, take a seat. Right over there. It's now, we're gonna try and assemble waitress. a composite photo of Aww. the suspect you saw. She looks so sweet. We have sweet. a computer program to help us. You'll see, it's really simple. It's kind of like a video game. Have you ever played a video game, Mrs. Morrison? No. No, those Mine are for fucking matter. losers. You're fine. The most important thing is to try to remember exactly what happened. The program consists of several types of facial features. You scroll through them until it looks like the man you saw. You understand? Oh, yes. Well, I think I do. Yes. Okay. Let's go. Oh my god. Do, do I get to make my own killer? Okay, I'm gonna make a really stupid looking guy. Duh, I'm a murderer. <laughs> uh, uh, I think I'm gonna kill someone. Uh. <laughs> mm. 
Mm. Whoa, give him a whiz face. <laughs> what if you actually like went to the police station to like <laughs> to make a guy that looks like this and they think you're just like fucking around but you're just like you s turn to them just like completely stone faced like no no this was the guy he, <laughs> he looks just like <laughs> can you take it all away can you take it all away <laughs> Like this. <laughs> how? Wait, how am I supposed to like make it look like Lucas? I don't know what the. Fuck you know that someone in the know. chat will look like what you will create there, right? Kecky W. No, nobody looks like this. Are you kidding me? <laughs> this looks like a fucking Beavis and Butthead NPC. <laughs> Nobody in the natural world looks like this. <laughs> now, is this the face of the person you saw? Yes. Yes. At least, th that's how I remember him. Thank you very much for your help. We're going to get this picture out to all the airports, trains, and bus stations, and to all of our patrolmen. If this guy is still in New York, this is actually gonna be in the game. Him. Like they're actually gonna put posters up. Go, <laughs> go buy a video game. Go buy a video game, bitch. Go take a shit. <laughs> oh my god. What if he like okay. sees the poster and he's like, oh my god, After it's me. The office, they know, they I know what I did. If I, wasn't going I should have shaved my mustache. I'm so totally exhausted that I can't fall asleep. I'm afraid of the dreams I might have. Me too. I wander around the room a little. I guess I'll go to sleep when I can't keep my eyes open I might longer. have a dream where my wiener has the hole in the side of it and the pee comes out the hole in the side instead of out the front where it's supposed to come out of and I get scared. And I have to wake up and get some water at 3 a.m. A man dove directly into the frozen water at Central Park today to save a child that was you, who had tumbled Lucas. in by accident. That was you. The young boy was successfully resuscitated and will completely recover. His courageous rescuer disappeared before the ambulance had even arrived. Apparently, well, you should have stayed and farmed hero. the good media coverage, bro. You fumbled the that. The investigation continues into the recent murder which took place at Doc's Diner. Police have today provided the a composite photo of the suspect based on information Do not given go by in there. a witness to the crime. If you see this man, please call the special number. Thanks, Nyan, for revealing my face to everyone now. out there. Now I need to shave and finally, finally and maybe grow some hair. <laughs> no, With don't shave the villain mustache. It looks cool. Can you turn on the, the TV really late at night as Lucas and watch Girls Gone Wild? Finally, oh my god. Okay, what should we do first? Let's turn on Theory for a Dead Man and just go wild on the punching bag. Maybe that'll help his mental elf. And now in an abandoned bar, move along, move along like I know you do, move along. Oh shit, wrong way, Lucas. Don't leave this on the me. Oh, 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 fuck you, fuck you, society, fuck you, fuck you. Ugh. I hate the world, I hate it, I hate, I hate the world, I hate, I hate everybody. Oh, I'm a misanthrope. I'm not racist, I, I hate everybody. Beautiful <sighs> 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 
Bro, is this gonna increase his physical stat? Like, is he gonna get, like, really buffed up and, like, strong? Did you see that flying kick? Wait, he actually knows Kung Fu. He has a book on it. Can you learn Kung Fu from a book? Seems like something you can have to be hands-on with. Ah! You can pretty much learn everything today from a fucking YouTube tutorial. Isn't that great? Like, you could probably learn martial arts through just YouTube. Something is changing inside me. I'm stronger and quicker. My god, what's happening to me? What? How did he... Lucas, why did you do that? That's gonna be a pain to hook back up. Alright, what if he starts playing the guitar and just fucking smashes it? <laughs> I gotta turn the amp on first. Something's happening to me. I, I gotta turn the amp on first. <laughs> I can shred on the guitar. Like crazy. I sound epic as fuck. Wait, if you fail the QTE, does it sound really bad? <gasps> cool blues. Let's play something cool. Let's play some Bossa Nova. What's happening to me? I'm suddenly really good at guitar. Wait, can you get a bonus for playing the guitar really good? Like, can it unlock something later? I'll I'll do it. I'll, I'll, I'll do it. Wait, something's not sitting right with me. Something is bothering the fuck out of me. Where is it? Where is it? What the fuck were you guys on the other side of the screen? It's fucking weird. Okay, there we go. I don't want the world to see me. And I don't think that you're under the And everything will seem to be broken. I don't want you to know who I am. Oh, he washed his bed. Alright, wait, why, did, why is there a penis? You see the penis painting? What is that? Lucas, what were you doing in there? Lucas, were you drawing penises again? It's okay, as long as it helps your mental elf. Oh shit, don't look at your dead parents. Put it back, put it back. My parents, Marcus and me. Don't! Before the accident. Stop! Can you just like repeatedly look at that and get really depressed? Time to do secret things on the computer at night. <laughs> All right, let's go to Web World News. Oh fuck yeah! <sighs> I'm just gonna sit here and stare at my desktop wallpaper for a little bit. God damn. Well, I guess this is how my story ends. Logged onto my computer and looked at my badass desktop wallpaper of a fighter jet. <laughs> it looks so cool. I found it on freewallpapers.net And at first I couldn't find the proper resolution But I kept looking And I found the perfect one Damn It's a shame nobody else aside from me will see this desktop wallpaper But I guess it's better that way No new messages, huh? Just another day in the life of Lucas and My little sweater You can't, like, jack off in this game, can you? Oh, man. Oh, man, I'm tired. It's time to play video game for five hours. <laughs> this guy is a psychopath! Who the fuck just, like,
like lays down to go to sleep like a fucking vampire in a casket, fully clothed with fucking shoes on. Okay, I changed my mind. He did kill that guy. I don't trust him. Can you take your medication? Take it right now, Lucas. Maybe he'll sleep better after taking his pills. He just tosses them just like that. Wait, that helped his mental elf. Oh my god, there's no saving this man. He's just... He's just sleeping like that. That's how you get sleep paralysis demons, bro. <gasps> Wait, Tiffany! <laughs> the way... Bro, the way his eyes slowly opened. Oh my god. <laughs> it was like that fucking emo. <laughs> I'm woke. Do you ever feel creepy as fuck looking through these little peepholes in the apartment doors? I hate doing it. I almost never do it. One of these days, I'm gonna get killed because I Hi. don't do that. Hi. Hi. I came to pick up my stuff. I hope I'm not disturbing you. No, I'm just a little bit sleepy. Are you a giant bug monster? This is my girlfriend, Tiffany. She has a little chopstick in her hair. Have a seat. XGF? Oh, why is he here then? Bro, come on. Respect yourself. I'll go and get your stuff. It's just two boxes. I'm not sure exactly where they'd be now, but they shouldn't be too hard to find. Uh, they've got my initials on them. Oh, she's here to pick up your stuff? I'll, I'll just throw it out into the fucking hallway. Get lost. She's somebody else's comrade now. Who gives a shit? Wait, what if I play guitar for her? And win her over. Can you? No. What if he just jumps out the window and kills himself in front of her? What if he sits down on the couch next to her and like inches closer and makes her really uncomfortable? Just piss really loudly in the room right next to her. And I don't want the world to see me. Cause I don't think that you'll own that you like Theory of a Dead Man, Tiffany. I, I've been getting into it lately. It's pretty cool. Uh, do you, do you want a glass of water? Yeah, he didn't wash his hands and he's gonna, he's gonna touch her. And get his pee pee hands all over her. Oh, is this her stuff right here? This guy is going to catch a cold. He just chills at his apartment all day with the windows open. Is that literally all her stuff? Just like... One singular box? Ew, there's probably girl stuff in here, like tampons. Here you go. She said two. When I was little, I used to think a couple meant like around three or four. Which makes no fucking sense. Because a couple literally means two. Or like a pair. And the reason why I had this misconception is because whenever my parents would refer to like things as like, oh, I'm gonna go grab a couple of these, they'd always come back with way more than two. So in my kid brain, I was thinking like, oh, a couple must mean around three or four things. Logically, for me, it made sense. Yeah, like a handful. Yeah, like I'm gonna grab a handful of some stuff. Hey, Tiffany, where the fuck is your other box? Where's Tiffany's box? That's a few. You're a few. A few years.
is too early to defeat me. This really is Average Man Simulator. Is this your other box right here, Tiffany? Oh, how quaint. Two little boxes for Tiffany's things. Oh, I'm Tiffany and I have just a couple boxes at your apartment. I just I just want to come pick up my boxes. Here they are. <laughs> I think that's everything. Is everything okay, Lucas? You look stressed. I killed a man. <laughs> Be, I've, I've Be got sincere. Some big problems right now. I can't really talk about it, but it's... Did you poop yourself at work again, Lucas? If there's anything that I can do for you, Lucas... Man, I wish there was, but no. Thanks for offering, though. Yeah, hey, sentimental. I, I miss you, you know? It'll help your I mental you health, too. Lucas. You have to be true to yourself. Wait. I just want to see if it'll work. What if it gives him plus 10 mental health? To give a woman a kiss. Which she doesn't want it, Lucas. I'm still not ready, Lucas. I need some more time to be alone. I'm sorry, I, I shouldn't have... What are the rumors, Tiffany? I'm gonna go. Thanks for everything. <laughs> Thanks for everything. Thank you, Lucas. What if she just doesn't know how to kiss and that's what she meant by I'm not ready? Like, she has to do... She has to watch more YouTube tutorials on it. What the fuck was that look? Oh, minus thirty mental I'd be health. Lying if I said I didn't want to, maybe it was better this way. After all, I had no idea what was going to happen to me in the next twenty-four hours. Wait, what's gonna happen? What could I offer at this point to a girl like Tiffany? By letting her go, I was protecting her. I went to bed. There was nothing else for me to do but try to sleep and find out what tomorrow was going to bring. Well, first, I shredded really epically I turn the amp on, first. on my guitar. I realized I need to turn the amp on first, and I turned it on. And then I picked up my electric guitar, and I did a cool guitar solo to let out my emotions after Tiffany left my apartment and left me in shambles when she refused my kiss. I'm gonna play a cool song. I played every note perfectly, and it sounded so cool. I started hoping that Tiffany was still outside the door and maybe overhearing how much better I got at guitar after she broke up with me. Oh, fuck, I fucked up the guitar solo. But then I started getting better at it. Gradually, I got back into the swing of things and it started sounding really epic. Are you listening now, Tiffany? Oh, fuck! I decided to put the guitar down for now because my hands still hurt after cutting myself with a knife. I'm gonna have to wait for my hands to heal to epically shred on the guitar again. I went into the kitchen and got a glass of water. I walked into the refrigerator for a really long time. Wait, maybe you should get drunk and go to sleep. I opened up the refrigerator and drank a bunch of milk. I kept guzzling down the milk until my tummy got really big and gurgly. I drank so much milk that my belly started feeling like it was going to burst. My belly started bouncing and trouncing around. Every step I took, I could hear the milk shaking around inside of my tummy. And it actually felt pretty nice. Mmm, milk cam. Does he have a camera in his refrigerator? After drinking so much milk, my belly was so full. I needed to take a little pee-pee. It bothers me that you can't see the stream of piss coming out. Not gonna lie. <laughs> I feel like it's just kind of lazy on the game developer's part. I can't even look at myself anymore. Well, actually, I can. I did a really good job shaving and my face looks really clean. I left the bathroom. 
feeling refreshed after taking a piss and washing my face and my hands. Well, all good, all good day's work. Hope I don't have any nightmares tonight. I really gotta put some WD-40 on my door hinges because they're so loud. And then I laid down completely flat on my back like a psychopath and drifted off to sleep again. What's gonna happen in the next 24 hours to Lucas? I don't think we're alone in this apartment, guys. <gasps> His desktop! I hate that he's still wearing his shoes in bed. No, is this real or is he just imagining this? Is there gonna be bug people in his apartment? What? <gasps> Bird. The bird is here. Lucas, what did you do? Lucas, don't leave the apartment. Don't leave the apartment in the middle of the night with creepy music playing. Don't... Lucas? Lucas, come on. No, don't you dare. Don't you dare leave the apartment complex. Well, in a trance. What the fuck? I saw a little kid again. Here's a five o'clock shadow. Already? That little girl again. She seems so real. I must be losing my mind. No, 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 Lucas. Uh, your medication is, is right next to the bed. Take it. Fuck. Okay. I want to see what Carla's up to. <laughs> I'm tired of this crazy guy. <laughs> all night. He's kind of stupid. Just, just added new ones. <laughs> Did the murderer intentionally give the victim a slow They're at the gym. Victim? Is there any link to the mysterious Kirsten case? Kickbox. Who sent me that email about Kirsten and why? This training session with Tyler is just what I need. I need to training my session. And just a little. I'm kind of Damn, sus you look of Carla. A bit, Carla. You sure you're cool? I'm fine. Why wouldn't I be? Okay. Let's Guys, warm up a stop bit, looking it. at her like that. Let She's a police officer. Okay. Sounds good. I was walking around with my titties out. And my armpit exposed. I'm breasting boobily. <gasps> she, she can do the, the she can do the, like uh, arm exercises. Let's go. Okay. Come on, come on, push it, push Ten. it, Carla, push it. One last set and I'll be ready to fight. Okay. I needed to do that to get the good ending. Wait, what else can she do? Can she punch the punching bag? Wait, what if she ends up having to fight Lucas? Because he's a fighter too. He knows Kung Fu. Oh god, she almost got punched in the face. Look out, Carla. Hydrate, Carla. Good, that helps your mental elf. I need to hydrate too. Mm. I take a sip of water, and then I do my arm exercises, and then I take a sip of water, and then I do my arm ex exercises. Oh, what's this exercise? She's gonna do, uh... Oh, she's doing girl crunches. One, two, three, four, <laughs> what if she let out a little squeaky five, fart? Six, <laughs> seven, eight, nine, nine ten... ten. I'm warmed up. I'm, I'm all warmed up. <laughs> she looks proud of herself. Wait, Tyler, spot me. Spot me, Tyler. Wait, can she not do the bench press? Wait, she can. 
Wait, no, only he can. What? What? Why does he walk like a Grand Theft Auto prostitute? Doesn't he? He has like more of a like girl walk cycle than she does. Guys, does anyone know where these gym is at? My friend wants to get arrested right now. By the... What, what do you mean by that? Look at... Bro, look at him! He walks like a fucking... Like he's gonna walk up to your car like... Hey, big boy! Hey there, big boy! He just needs like fishnets and stuff. Wait, I wonder if she can spot him. Carla, spot me! What if I fuck it up? Oh, oh, I can't do it. Oh. Yo, I need to do my whole warm up routine in order to get really ready. True. Okay. What's this warm up routine? We try. What the? F what is? She, what, what the fuck is she doing? What the fuck was she doing in the corner? One. Push it. Two. Push it, Tyler! Three. Push it, Tyler! Push it! Four. Come on! Come on! Five. Come on! He's gonna do the eight-hour arm workout. Come Six. on! Seven. What the fuck? This is actually hard! Come on, you have to... Eight. There's a girl in here. You have to impress her. You can't look weak. Only eight? Come on, Tyler! Nine. Ten! We need ten! Ten, 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 ten! Ah, shit! Come on, come on, Tyler! Ten! Come on, Tyler! Ten. Yes! Yeah, I'm in pretty good shape this morning. One more set <sighs> and I'll be ready to get in the ring. Holy shit. Bro, I actually got sweaty doing that. That is so sad. These QTEs, they were not kidding when they... What the fuck is she doing? They were not kidding about the QTEs in this game. They are actually difficult. Okay, hydrate, Tyler. That was a good set, Tyler. Good hustle. I like when the water bottle clips into their entire face. Okay, what about... Whoa, what, what's this machine? I feel kind of intimidated. Come on, Tyler, let's set off the lunk alarm. One. One. Two. What the fuck is she Three. doing in the background? Four. Bro, she's like those TikTok Five. girls recording like gym videos. Like, this creepy guy was Six. looking at me and I don't understand why. And she's just like shaking her ass. Seven. Come on! Eight. Come on, we need ten. Ten, Tyler, ten. Nine. Nine. Ah, my fucking hands are gonna fall off. Why is this so hard? Come on! Come on, don't let's get leg day. Cool. I'm ready to rock. Wait, that was it? He did like ten bench presses and ten leg presses. What about, what about these? Wait, how many did Carla do of these? Bro, my heart is actually racing. <sighs> my hands hurt. I feel like I was actually working out. Want a box? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Las Vegas for tonight's match between Terrible Tyler Miles and Killer Carla. Valente. Killer Carla? Okay, who do you guys think is gonna oh, win? Yeah, and who's always kicking out the crap about me acting like a kid all the time? <laughs> <laughs> I was just about to say that's kind of out of car character for Carla. Out of Carla. What the? Is this what people do when they box? They do like little like jumps in the air? Okay, shit! Ugh, fuck! I'm gonna let him get his ass beat by a girl. Shit. What the fuck is this like kung fu shit? Oh shit! 
Yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh God. <laughs> Come on, give it all you got, Tyler. And he's just like fucking roundhouse kicks her to the face. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit, Tyler, look out! It's three Carla, two Tyler. What again? What happens if Carla wins versus Tyler? Is she gonna be like, <laughs> how does it feel to be beat by a girl? Damn, Kyla, you nasty. I love her little helmet. Shit, <laughs> 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 oh no, these kids are so bad. The Simon Says thing is gonna fuck me up so bad. Oh god. What the hell? Is there anything you can get Tyler some points? Like, come on. Nice. Nice. So you can kind of... Oh my god! <laughs> He's gonna fucking put her in a wheelchair. What the fuck, Tyler? <laughs> Killer Carla. <gasps> the finishing move, Carla Valenti. Ding 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 ding. I was raised in the Shaolin Monastery. The monks taught me all the evil secrets of Kung Fu. What? No shit. Man, Tyler, you don't believe anything I tell you. Yo, nothing about you, Carla. That was racist as hell. And then he just fucking punches her. <laughs> Okay, grasshopper, if you're a glutton for punishment, I'm up for it. <laughs> Let's just beat the shit out of her. <laughs> I love the fucking kitties. Oh, whose turn is it? I was raised by Shaolin monks. <laughs> Can you take it all away? <laughs> Bro, it's so brutal and he just kicks her in the stomach and she goes flying. It's awful. And it's just like fatality. Rips her heart out through her mouth. You cool? <laughs> yeah. And then her teeth are that. falling out. That's what I like about you, Carla. You take it just as good as you give it. What the Wanna fuck? No. <sighs> the fuck no, does he mean? What? He shouldn't like I'm anything about her. He has a fucking girlfriend. Fuck you, Tyler. Can't get that restaurant murder out of your head, huh? <laughs> I just feel like there's a piece of the puzzle. Missing. Would it make you feel better if you did a stereotypical you accent again, Carla? Psycho. Would it? Story. Yeah, maybe. Y yeah. I just want to find him and make sure <laughs> okay. he never does Okay, uh, uh, just this once, Carla. I won't okay. tell anybody. Guy who leaves that oh, much evidence nice. behind on a murder one, he's gonna slip up somewhere. I hope it's that simple, Tyler. I really do. I'm sorry, Tyler. I get really racist when I'm stressed. Ten years. 
ten years since my parents were killed in a car accident. I've never completely recovered from losing them. You never really get over something like that. Oh no, he's going to put flowers on their grave. Lately, I thought maybe I should go and meditate at their grave a little this morning. I'm gonna go masturbate at their grave. I love this layout where it's like all the different camera angles, very cinematic and avant-garde. You could tell that David Cage had a, a vision for this that he was very passionate about. Shaolin monks. Speed run. Okay, we're gonna clip through the wall and then we're gonna go to the grave and we're gonna put the flowers and we're gonna save all these three frames. And we're gonna skip the crying cutscene by mm, having an A press. Good. I'm happy that you could come. Who, me? <laughs> Where the fuck are you? John and Mary came. Wait, the guy who died? His name was John, too. Is that just a coincidence? It's such an uncommon name. Lucas, come on, Lucas, come and play. You can't spend your whole life just sitting in the corner. Lucas, let's play doctor. Lucas. Lucas. <laughs> Lucas. Sometimes it Lucas feels like I'm coming? peeing, but the white stuff to comes out. Lucas, leave me alone. I've about had it with you, Lucas. <laughs> You're always off by yourself. You never talk to anyone. You never play with anyone. <laughs> what is this in the 1940s? <laughs> what You're the weird, fuck? For sure. How old is, is this guy? Bad? Come on, do me a favor. Just play with everybody this one time. No. Oh. They're lame. I want to play Bionicle. How about hide and seek? We could go play in Hangar 4. No way. You know we're not allowed to play in there. Wait, is this why he's obsessed with planes? We can get into that hole in the fence like last time. Nobody will see us. We can get inside the hangar from the back door. Good idea. Let's do it. Is he a time traveler? Are you coming with us, Lucas? I don't understand this, like... It even has, like, the old-timey filter on it, like, it's, uh... ...from an age-long past. Now I'm little boy, Lucas. <laughs> Wait, did he have visions even all the way back here? No, he's cheating at hide-and-seek! His friends are gonna hate him! Oh. Oh no. <gasps> what the fuck? Why are they playing at a fucking military base? And you're four. It's gonna burn. <gasps> we have and to... will get caught in the fire. We have Chris, to save them. Warn someone. We've gotta save them before it's too late. Oh no. I have a feeling we don't save them. Uh, this way, Lucas. Wait, there's soldiers patrolling the area, like in fucking Metal Gear. Oh no. Wait, please don't tell me this is gonna be like some stealth shit. I see like, I see like stealth icons on the map with like the, the eyeballs, you know, with like the cone of sight. No. How do I get in there? I'm gonna have to find another way in. I have to get to Hangar 4 before they all die. You know what? Why don't we just let them all die? You know? Like, what's the worst that could happen? Okay, there's nobody looking over here. Let's just go this way. And then we might be able to crawl through the fence up here. <laughs> this is giving me PTSD flashbacks. I hate stealth games. I really do. The only thing that kept me invested in Metal Gear was how like quirky the story was, and like some of the like shooting sections were fun as fuck. But fuck stealth, I hate it. It's my worst nightmare. You want me to pay attention and like move slowly and carefully through an area? Fuck no. Can I crawl up here? Can I crawl under the fence? 
Wait, what if I just wait for him to leave? Can I crawl on the ground? Oh. Can I go pee pee? Excuse me, sir. I need to go pee pee. Other side? This other side? Yeah, there's like a green line, which makes me think I need to follow the green line, but... 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 but, but, but. Like right here, right? Right here. Wait. Wait a minute. I'm gonna have to find another way around. Okay, I found another way around. Cool. Okay, then we just, uh... Go through. <laughs> but it's closed! What do I what do? How do I get through? Check tarp on fence? Okay, okay, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Tarp on the fence. Tarp on the fence. Where is the tarp on the fence? I don't remember. This tarp? I thought this was a bunch of dirt. Oh. <laughs> oh, cool. Oh, shit. Fuck. Come on, Lucas. Use your kid strength. Even if you break a bone, it's fine. Okay, perfect. We're in. He jumped down like a Spider-Man. Now he's crawling. Just crawling in the shadows. I think I'd rather my friends die in a fire explosion than have to do a cell section in a video game. But that's just my angry video game no opinion of the day. If my friends theoretically were all in a, like a military base that was about to explode... ...and I had to do a really long drawn out cell section to save them... Mm, let's just say... I'm thinking obvious. Look out, little kid. Anytime something ridiculous happens in this game, Niner Machines, son. What the? <laughs> Niner Machines? Wait. I see. I see him. Don't move off, shoot. Ah, you. I thought he was looking the other way. It, on the map, it looked like. Wishita. On the map, it looked like he wasn't looking this way. But where is he? Where is this man? Should I just hug the wall here? Don't move or I'll shoot! Oh, fuck you! You know what? I changed my mind. I hate the military. I don't care that they're protecting our country. They suck. Is he gonna look the other way? Or is he just gonna keep being a little bitch about it? Behind car, <gasps> the car that passes through. <gasps> You're a genius. Don't move I, I didn't time it. 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 Okay, wait for the car to come. What if we just go to this box? Okay, here comes the truck. Okay, as soon as the truck comes, we're just gonna. Okay, he's gonna go in front of that guy. Okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna... He doesn't see me. Oh god, hurry, 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 <laughs> Why doesn't he just, like, go up to the... Nice soldier man and say... Oh fuck, I went the wrong way. of the truck earlier. We just go straight that way, right? I oh, off, you motherfucker! I barely moved! Why 
I listen to a smelly kid? Because soldiers are here to protect us or something. Help! My friends are in that silo and it's gonna explode, please! Like, like that's all you have to say. Dumb over oh, shoot. I love too early. I'm wearing a uniform and I shoot guns and then... Fuck you. Is he gonna... He's really threatening to shoot a child too. That's kind of fun. Oh, don't move bro. Don't move. Don't move or he'll shoot. Whoa, whoa, Waggy. What? Okay. Dumb uh, over, I'll shoot. What? Bro, I'm about to look up a fucking YouTube video of someone doing this to see how to do it and then just replicating that. Dumb over, I'll shoot. <laughs> uh, Just tell them my taxes pay your salary. That always make them very happy to hear. Wang. Oh, okay. Maybe that'll make them want to help us. Okay. Just wait for this really slow truck to pass by. And then... We just go until we're in front of the guy. Like this? Don't move or I'll shoot. Oh, <laughs> what do I do? What the fuck? What do I actually do? I need to get... Ooh. I need to get to this 4B right here. 4B for me. Just follow the truck I did last time and they saw me. Okay, like this? Okay, there's another guy right there. Okay. Now he doesn't see me somehow. Save your friends, bucko! But you're gonna be really happy that your friends didn't die. Come on, get in there. Leave it to Beaver. Lucas, what are you doing here? I thought you didn't want to play. Get out of here now, Marcus. The hangar's going to explode. They're not going to huh? listen to him. How can that... Don't ask any questions, Marcus. Get out now. It's about to explode. I'll keep looking <laughs> for the others. <laughs> what is... That's like a fucking 30-year-old man blessing a child. Oh, no. Oh, fuck this. Uh, get to the chopper! Ooh, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> uh, uh, guys, where's the exit? <laughs> uh, where did my friends go? It was so hard to get on those stairs. You have no fucking idea. Please tell me I don't have to do more stealth shit once I get out of here. And the Oscar for doing, Best Voice Lucas? Acting goes to that chair actor, Sir Kaz. The over. Everybody chair gone. actor. Can come out now. It can come oh, out now. Great. Why didn't anybody tell me? Oh, just great. I wanted to die. Where's the rest of them? Where's the rest of my friends? Uh, is there a kid under here? If I was a kid and I was playing... Hide and seek, and I'm military bunker. Where would I go? How many children even were there? I don't even remember. We found the the nerd kid. We found the kid in the white shirt. Wasn't there a kid in a red shirt? Oh god, it's bro, it's so hard to move around. I wish I could like show you guys how hard it is to move in this Bug game. Off, Lucas. You're going to give me away. Red shirt guy. The going to explode. You got to get out of here right now. 
What kind of crap is this? You get out of here and stop trying to ruin the game. You are going to get out of the hangar right now. I'm not kidding. <laughs> Shit, Lucas, you're a total nutcase. <laughs> You're gonna get out of here right now. <laughs> Wait, there's was there one more kid? Where's the oh god? It was right here. Fuck. Fuck. I don't know where the kids are. I don't know where the where the kids are. Where are the boys? Where are the boys at? Oh, whoa, whoa. Uh oh, guys, hoey, we're gonna die. Wait, what if there's someone in here and I miss them? Where is the exit? I don't know where the fu I can't. What? Bro, why is he walking this way? What am I? Ah! I'm out of time. I gotta get out of here before everything explodes. Okay, then do it. Oh, uh, did we get everybody? Lucas, are you hurt? No, just a few scratches. And the others. Jason. I did everything I could, Marcus. I didn't... I didn't manage to get them all out. Why did he smile? How did you know what was going to happen, Lucas? I saw it. I saw it before it happened. Don't ask me how. You know they'll never believe that. I know. Lucas? Are you I know. Right, Lucas? <laughs> Lucas, <laughs> can you hear me? Wait, does that change anything major in the story? I like... did a little checking around. Without giving your name, obviously. I was told what if I didn't a find a single one of them. With, let's say, unusual no, it's fine. Phenomena. It's fine that there's a dead child. I think that maybe she could help you. Oh, it just makes him a Here. little more depressed. This it's is okay. He can get drunk and uh, he, and he'll you know get that plus I don't ten. Believe in any of this, Lucas, but I sincerely hope that she can give you some kind of answer. I hope so too. <laughs> Bro, the kids, <laughs> like, face animations are so funny. You're going to get out of this silo right now. Should we be Tyler or Carla? I guess they're both at the police station. It don't matter. It don't matter, so, none. So, how's that restaurant murder case coming along? We've got a few leads, but no suspects for the moment. There's some troubling elements about this case. We know it probably wasn't premeditated, and it wasn't done for money. What's your theory? The guy was stabbed. Several elements match the M.O. of a serial killer. They like to kill up close, often use knives, and like to leave clues for the stupid police. This yeah, like would the explain book. the quantity of the clues. 90% of the time, these guys are white, and they kill other whites. It's not a bad match. Do you think there's much chance he'll kill again? Uh, yes. It seems likely. He got away with this one, everything went perfectly, so he's probably feeling very powerful. Seems likely he'll do it again as soon as he thinks he can. Am I good at being I a detective? I can't tell. Bars ASAP. Do whatever you have to do. So, what's the plan now? Check the local hospitals to see if they've had any men with knife wounds in. Check with all the psycho wards to see if they've got any ex-patients out on Did the street. Did she say psycho Might ward? Have been capable of something like this. Okay. The Anything place else? where they keep all the yeah. psychos. Yeah, found under the table. Garrett left it on your desk. See if you can make anything of it. Okay, Ooh. I'll get on all that stuff right away. What are you gonna work on? There's something that I need to verify. <laughs> I need to as do today's crossword remember, puzzle. I've been frightened by small spaces. Whenever I'm in a small, confined place, I start to panic. I have trouble breathing, and I need to get out right away. Yeah. You've heard the name. Claustrophobia. Claustrophobia. Well, I had decided not to let my fear control me. I decided to try and fight it. Every oh, cool, a card. I'm going to stay calm. Everything is going to be fine. I'm going to imagine that I get shrunk down to the size of an ant. Walk without stopping until I find the computer terminal. What if I was shrunk down to the size of an ant? inside of a, a woman's home, and I had to cling to the rug for dear life while she vacuums it. How was Mol Molten Core? Oh, uh, it was gr great to... to watch. 
It was great when I was sitting in my room alone watching it and there fighting back tears. Around here. It was cool. It gave me momentary uh, happiness. Press the L button, the R button up to make Carla breathe. I have to make her breathe? I'm freaking oh. out. Oh fuck, I, I made her freak breathe. out. Oh, no. oh shit. I gotta get out of here. Carla, you suck. You suck at breathing. I'll come back later. I can control my fear. Wait, no, go back and try again. Get back up. Come on, Carla. You can do it. Come on, don't give up. Quitters are cringe. Come on. What what am I doing? What, I am, I, do what am I doing wrong? It's just too much for me. No, I can't even breathe right. I'm such a stupid idiot. <laughs> I think this was a PS2 game. It's from 2005. Come on, Carla, you can do it. Do I have to do it more slowly? Wait. I, I don't... I don't I understand. It. It's just too much for me. A girl who has a phobia of small faces will have to go down through an area with small spaces instead of asking I don't know her partner to help? Well, you see, Carla is trying to overcome her fears. She's being strong, okay? She doesn't want to rely on somebody else. Fucked it up. Ooh, wait, Carla, Car breathe, Carla, breathe. Hold on, Carla. Whoa. Willie, this is Willie. What it feels like to manage your anxiety when you when you're about to freak out. Sometimes we all can be a little bit like Carla. My name Kawa. Oh shit, Carla. Oh shit. We're gonna have to do this one too. Come on, Carla. Stay calm. We're almost there. On the home stretch, Carla. Come on. Here's the archive terminal. Ooh. I can consult the file here. The save files oh, are classified. I'm gonna by freak you. out. <laughs> the cursed files should be in the 1990s. It shouldn't be too hard to find. The 1990s, huh? The 1990s. 1975. 1980. Oh, oh fuck, Carla! I wasn't paying attention. Oh, it's just too much for me. Carla, you dumb bitch. Stop having anxiety and just do it. Who cares? Well, you're literally just like performing this for like just yourself. Like, what is the point of this? Like, this is performative anxiety. Oh no, I can't do it. Oh, fuck you. Just walk. Just walk a straight line. Just go to the fucking 1990s now. You're not in a movie, Carla. Nobody's gonna look at you freaking out and be like, Whoa, she's so good at freaking out. She looks so... So convincing. Fuck you, Carla. 1990s? Right here, right here, Carla. We can do it. Yeah, just don't be stressed. Have you ever thought of that? Stop it. Right here. Oh, 
Here's the file starting with K. Just need to check to make sure I've got the right year on the terminal. I feel like the right year is probably uh, maybe here. Wait, can I not do this? Until I've, I'm done with the first one? What if it's not the right one? She's gonna freak out. Please don't freak out, Carla. Put it the thingy in the thingy. There's no power to the terminal. I guess there must be a switch box somewhere. Huh. Oh no. Oh god, this is the worst. We have to, we have to find the switch box while trying not to freak out. <laughs> Okay. Okay, I guess we can. Where could it be? If I was a switch box. Think about your breathing, Carla. Think about it. But don't think about it too hard. Then you'll start freaking out. Then you'll start like noticing that your heart is beating too fast and you'll get kind of scared. Fuck! Carla, go back! Carla, whatever you do, don't think about how your tongue is not sitting comfortably in your mouth. And it feels like your tongue is too big for your mouth. Carla, whatever you do, do not become very aware of your insides moving around inside your stomach. Just don't freak out. Carla, whatever you do, don't think about how your brain is inside your skull right now when you can feel your brain and it feels kind of heavy Carla, where's the switch box? Is it this thing? I don't know what anything is in this game N nothing makes sense This? I think this just goes back to the entrance Wait, Carla Carla, wait! What if we go... Uh... This way? Fuck! Carla! I can't take it. It's just too much for me. But at least it saves your progress on the thingies. Get up, Carla. Come on, this is gonna be the time that we, we finally get this done. And you're gonna be so glad that you did it. You're gonna be so glad you persevered. Come on, don't have a woman moment. It up. Be cool. Be cool and chill. Imagine the small spaces are just really dumb and you're making fun of them. Like, oh, I'm a small space. Oh, I'm small and claustrophobic. Ooh. This thing. <laughs> Come on, Carla. Come on, just a little... Wait, I think I have to move something else before I move this one. Oh god, Carla... No, I didn't mean to do that again. I didn't mean to do that three times. Get out of there, Carla! Carla! Maybe I have to go in the other side. What if we put a puzzle in a game? And then made it so you have to like manage your breath the entire time you do it. Oh, the irony. After failing this a few times, you will get to have an anxiety attack similar to the main chair actor. Yeah, it'll be really immersive. Maybe David Cage was onto something. What if we made people really like annoyed and pissed off while playing a video game? So they feel like the characters. Now we move this one. Move it, Carla. Yes, Carla. Good. Good job, Carla. Just a little bit more, Carla. Oh, oh no. It's getting d d d d d dull. Cut. I just need to stay calm. Just stay. I will control my fear. Yes, you will. You can push past this, Carla. This is nothing. You can do it. Uh, does it need to move more, or... 
It looked like it, it didn't. It looked like it didn't move enough. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll put it back. We'll put it back. Now we can look. No, 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 Carla, 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 Carla. Come, 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 Red, green, and gold. Carla, I can't manage your breath and mine breath at the same time. If we're both managing our breath, then who, who, who is playing the g -g 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 game? Carla. Okay, okay, okay. Mm, that one. Okay, no, no, it goes this way. Ah, we <laughs> we. What if I made my video game really fucking stupid? <laughs> oh, we oui, we. Oui. What if we put in a ten minute long lesbian sex scene? Manage your breathing, Carla. Why are French people so fucking weird? I'm sorry. I mean, I appreciate what they do for like the, the artistic world, but like, why are they so weird? Yeah, what happened to training with Shaolin monks, Carla? I have to stay calm and control my breathing. Oh man. It's starting. My hands. They're shaking. Oh, my hands are shaking so bad. My heart is racing. I'm gonna Just hyperventilate. Go to stay calm. To stay calm, okay. Can't what? Let the fear get what? Out of control. What helps me stay calm? I I have to do racist voice impressions. Okay. Alright, Carla, stay calm. Uh Mamma Mia! Papa Mia! Okay, okay, good, good. I'm doing it. You can do this, Carla. Just stay calm. Wait, uh Did I bring the power back or uh what I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. Is it back? The, the, the lights turned off and then they turned back on when I... Did, 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 did. Guess there must be a switch box somewhere. Oh. I didn't know there was a wire on the wall the last time I saw that cutscene. Because I was too busy being angry and ticked off. Okay. I'll just move this this way. I guess I'll just move this... Wait. No, Carla! Oh. I forgot to manage her breathing. Take... It's just too much for me. And now she's depressed. You can't do anything right. Bro, just switch to the guy. But wait! What if I get a really good ending because I helped Carla overcome her fear? Like, what if, like, this cements in her head, like, I can do anything, and then she ends up, like, saving the day by crawling into a really tiny crawl space to save somebody? That's the... That's the wire on the wall, right? That thingy right there? We, it's literally that! Wait... No, that turned it off. What the fuck? Wait, it's not that? Is it... This thing? That looks like a switch box. I made it even worse. Carla, you just fuck everything up. You're not good at anything. You should just... It's a different wire. Okay, it's the one that's... Uh, it's the one... By the... Uh, the map of New York. Okay. Control your breathing, Carla. Uh, oui, oui, uh, croissant. Uh, what if, uh, what if we had to manage uh, Carla's fear? What if we helped uh, a woman overcome her fear of claustrophobia? <gasps> there it is, Carla! Go, Carla, go! You can do it! Just a little more, Carla. Non! Non! C'est si bon! Come on, Carla. Stay la vie. Okay, now it's, it's only gonna stay on for 10 seconds, and if I don't make it back there in time, I have to do it again. 
Sakhli blue. I did it. Ubris's voice impressions helped. I overcame my fear. Hmm. Nothing on Kirsten. Must not be the right disc. Oh. No. All right, put it out. Okay. We need to go into the other 1990s section. The one that I was fucking around with. Uh, somewhere. Out there. Somewhere this way. Yeah, yeah, down here, down here, down in here, down in here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, this is the part that I did prematurely. I think. What if we made you search for a tape? While making you manage the protagonist's the fear of claustrophobia. Just need to check. I'm gonna check the disc I've got before I take another one. Sammy, Anne, okay. this is where the femme of Jane developed David Cage Reed. The double sent to for the new work. For verse in a game, this game has been the work of my passion. This game is a masterpiece. To stay calm. Oh, can't let the fear. I think I found it. You found it, Carla. You did it. Fire You're a hero. No report, no evidence, nothing. Just your gut. Hmm. 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 Hmm.
the librarian now. Look at me, look at me, look at me. I'm the librarian. Hey, look, I if you need to check out a book, I'll I'll be your guy. He's just looking at me. <laughs> Fuck. Uh okay. Uh maybe there is something I can do for you. What would that be, sir? One client order very rare book. Since this morning I Oh my god, who was this guy? You find this book and I tell you all you want to know. What is on his pinky finger? So what does it look like this? Book uh, yeah, I think want? it's just like a French guy or something. Ah, easy. David Cage it's from voice the same him? collection as this one. Okay. It's his coke I now. To that. <laughs> Bring back the sacred the Chinese librarian is doing coke. Mountain, <laughs> and he will give you the magic talisman. Oh man. <laughs> what am I in a video game? <laughs> Holy fuck, this is the best game ever made. This reminds me of that the room in Dark Souls 3 where you start the DLC with the guy who's like on his hands and knees. But like slightly more racist. Uh, excuse me, uh... Takao? What's his name? Wait, 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 wait. There was something over here. What was the... the look... look... see, there's like a looky looky. If the book you're looking for isn't here, then it doesn't exist. It's a Shakespeare Thousands book. Thousands of old books. There's gotta be a Shakespeare book in here. Like, it's like one of the most uh, important pieces of literature in our time. Smells like dust and old paper. Did David Cage really voice him? Hold on. Um, let's see. What's the guy's name again? I didn't catch it. His name was, uh... Michael. Benedict Cumberbatch. This is who voiced him? Oh. And who voiced him? Not a good look, Chris. Not a good look. But I guess it was another time, so... You know, just, uh, just a little ignorant, I guess. I don't know. I didn't know he got his start in voice acting like that. It kind of puts a sour taste in my mouth. <laughs> Sweet and sour <laughs> God damn it, Chris! We were rooting for you! No, it was voiced by a guy named like Paul Derbyshire or something. Some like weird British man. But Chris is not going to get off easy for not being Italian and voicing Mario, that's for sure. We should not let him live that one down. <laughs> Where the fuck is this bug? Wait, what is this thing? Wait a minute. Oh, everything is in like, library code. Okay. Silverberg! Thielman, Vandervale. Are these all author names? Okay, so if we're looking for a Shakespeare book, we need to look in the 1700 section, right? 
or fart. Wait, who voices Tyler? Uh, what what do they what do they look like? Can you give me a description? I did not... I couldn't pay it... Bro, could you pay attention during that cutscene? I was so... <laughs> it was so bad! I was like sweating the entire time watching it. I was like, am I allowed to like broadcast this on Twitch? I feel like... <laughs> someone's gonna tap into the stream and see me watching this and think... I'm like... <laughs> this game was made in 2005, okay? Move the magnifying glass with the joystick or the direction keys. The Tempest? The Tempest. Okay, or... There might be some kind of hidden code. William Shakes. P pair. William Shakes pair. Wait, what does this say? To my brother... Br 18th Something birthday. Written in pencil here. MK. To my brother for his 18th birthday. MK. MK. What does MK stand for? Oh, interesting. McDonald. Who is MK? Willy Wonka? Walter White? Oh. There might be a clue. <laughs> I'm gonna get a really big clue. I think I just got a clue too. <laughs> Michael Keaton from a Jack Frost. Looks like a computer printout of a bunch of numbers mm. fell out of the book. Must have been a bookmark. Wait, I'll that was from the oh, oh, that, that, that was from the book of the way we were looking at the, the front, isn't it? It matches the. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. I think he's waiting for me to bring back his stupid book. It's not stupid, Tyler. Come on. It's Shakespeare. This thingy. Isn't it just like that? Okay, Tyler, get the book. I love this music. You know what? Today I was thinking about playing Fallout. I'm still thinking about playing it. But I'm glad I played this today. Because this is exactly what I needed. My brain has been craving this type of garbage. Hey, take the book. We're gonna give it back to the nice old man. Uh, hello? Uh, d doesn't he want this? Your brain has been craving racist accents? No, not that part, not that part. I mean, just like, uh, the entire movie is like a... Like a... Not movie, I mean game. I wonder where the comics are kept. Come on, Tyler. Not everything is about comics and video games. What's that expression about a haystack? A uh, needle in a haystack? Is there something else I must find in this book? What? Can I not look at it anymore with the magnifying glass? Oh, you can ask him about books that you bring to him. Why can't I ask about this one? It has the thingy on it, as if I'm allowed to ask him, but he does not respond. Do they have any picture books? I don't... I don't like these. Maybe I can pick books up at that, that, that table, and then... <sighs> okay, we're on to something. Crunks, thank you for, for gifting those subs. It's time to get crunk. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh yeah, put the book down. Let's go grab another one. Thank you for gifting those subs. 
Remember when people used to say get crunk? People not say that anymore. People I just think say he's waiting for me to bring back his stupid book. But I Tyler Wait, what is what's what's glowing here? There's something I can pick up here. Right here? Yeah, he can hear you, Tyler. Be respectful. Oh, uh, what's this one? Okay, here's your book. What if he just starts talking I extremely say, normally? Baby, you got problem with your eyes. Oh yeah, this it's book is uh, green eggs and ham. Alright, alright. I'll keep looking. Mm hmm. What book do I bring him? Is it not the Tempest? Yeah, I'm getting I'm getting minuses to my mental. My mental elf. We need to bring him some manga. Um, excuse me, manga is Japanese, not from China. Okay, here's your book. Does he have to I bow think, like that? You got a problem with your eyes. This not book I want. Alright, alright. I'll keep looking. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, maybe the book we need is upstairs. Wait, what if it's this one? Don't spoil the surprise. What do you mean the surprise? He wants the art of war. Very funny, chat. Very funny. You guys need to go to sensitivity okay, training. Here's your book. I think maybe you got problem with your eyes. This <laughs> not the book I want. Why does he smile like I, that every I, time? I'll keep looking. And what is this guy wearing? Something tells me this library has secrets. He's being polite? Yeah, I guess so. I guess he's just being polite and chill. Having to swap around the camera angle every time I like turn a corner is so painful. This has some some lion secrets. Okay. What about this one? What about this one, sir? Okay, here's your book. I think maybe you got problem with your eyes. What? This not book I want. What's the book you I, want? I'll keep looking. Have you ever seen that episode of Nathan for you where? Oh, I don't even want to finish this sentence. <sighs> Wait, is it random? Like, which book it is? There's even- there's another section up above. There's multi- multiple levels! The colors on the shelves are important. It's color-coded? Okay, here's your book. I think maybe you got problem with your eyes. <coughs> this not book I want. Okay, 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 just tell me where it is. I don't want to watch another cutscene of the nice old man bowing respectfully. I don't even know what book we're looking for. Not the Kama Sutra. <laughs> hold on, hold on, I have to adjust the camera so he doesn't walk into a wall. Is it this one? How do you, how are you supposed to pay attention during that? Are you, okay? You guys weren't paying attention either because you would have been saying like, Oh, you said this, 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 this. You guys were too busy getting your yucks. Getting your fucking yucks and your yucks. Oh my god, what the fuck was that? 
We respect your elders. I don't know. This guy is kind of rude. Keep saying he has a like. This guy has a problem okay, with his here's eyes. Okay, your book. Oh, great! You found it. I found Thanks, it. Thanks, dude. What do you want to know about that book? Uh. Is it just me, or did you lose your accent? Oh yeah, that's for the customers. What? They love that wise old Japanese master stuff. I was born in Brooklyn, man. I never been no further than Long Island. Hey, I'm more American than you are, man. Oh my God! Can you tell me anything about the book? Yes, yeah, nice edition. No Leather cover fucking way. Looks like one in the Shakespeare series published by Lamarck and Everett, 1884. Yo, thanks for your help. No problem. <laughs> Come by again, okay? Well, this is awkward. <laughs> what if he's disappointed? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I thought this was gonna be like that movie Gremlins. I thought I was gonna go home with a magical creature today. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> oh, wait. Okay. Should we switch to Lucas? He's at Agatha's house. Who's Agatha? Who the heck is Agatha? Man, every time it switches to Lucas, it's so depressing. Can this I get is the hit by a car? Oh. There's no point looking any further. But I want to go Here for the walkies. Okay. Keep your composure, Lucas. We're going to ring the doorbell, right? Three, two, one. Jesus, that's loud. Uh. Should I just wait for her to come to the door, or...? It's cold. I shouldn't just open the door and go in, right? That's like breaking in. Hello? What? It's not locked. He's not gonna kill again, is he? Is there anyone here? Oh, she's a psychic. Is anyone at home? Those camera angles were cool. Candlesticks, an old grimoire. Weird atmosphere. A stuffed crow. Maybe she knows something. Sheets on all the furniture, as if the house hasn't been lived in for a long time. Yeah, how does he know how to pronounce Gwim... Gwimwire? A sort of African totem. I'm going home. <laughs> Wait, this is her. Oh. Hello, Agatha. Are, are you Agatha? Why do you want to talk to Agatha? I need help. I was told that she could help me. Help you? Tell me. Who on this earth doesn't need a little help? She's from Bloodborne. Why? What? What the fuck One is he doing? Not have eyes to see. Oh my God, Lucas! Kind, what man. are you doing? Push me over to my birds. It'll be more comfortable for us to talk over there. Yeah, I'll push you to the birds. And what if, what if I push her into the bathroom and she's talking to the toilet the entire time? Wait, this is just like Detroit Become Human. You have to pre like push a guy in a wheelchair in that game, too. <laughs> David Cage really loves sections like this, doesn't he? Uh, wee wee. 
I certainly understand this. Huh? About boosting someone in a wheelchair in my game. Oh uh, fuck! Uh, shit! Sorry, Agatha. Here, your birds are. Oh, there's a bird right here. You want to talk to this bird? This one? Or the the crow? Agatha. This one right here, right? <laughs> oh yes, yeah, you'll see. It's a very, it's like a real life. Wait, I hear the birds. Are they in this room? Here they are. Oh, they're alive birds, not Anyone stuffed you ones. interact within this game Bird under 50, seems this town is nothing but senior citizens that belong in the old folks home. What? There, there's so many people under 50. Though the main characters are like in their thirties. Tell me, what is your cage like? It's a David cage. I killed a man. It, it was like I was <laughs> possessed. I watched it all happen, but I had no control over my actions. Sounds like a rather common place. Well, that's our fucking me. crazy. Please Don't get you out of think here. That it might simply be because you've gone mad. I had a vision of, of another. I had to man drink water. Making exactly the same movements as me, and of a little girl who called out to me for help. In the cupboard, you will find a little bag of seeds. Be a good boy. Feed some to my little darlings, will you? They're gonna pick his eyes out. What if he just leaves? Oh god. Maybe it's in the lower drawer? Ooh. Oh, there's a new Chills art game I saw. I saw Forsen playing it. The Jisatsu one? Jisatsu. Yo, if she gets up and she's he's like, what? Whoa, you're walking? What the hell? Oh, yeah, I, I, just, I just do the wheelchair thing because people like the old lady in the wheelchair thing. <laughs> yeah, I'm from the Bronx. And then they start making out. Have you experienced any other strange manifestations since then? Have you had any odd dreams or visions? Yes. What if there was a sexy Yuri scene with the old the lady in a wheelchair and becoming horrible? Uh, are you able to attach anything the concrete lady from the bookstore, to vision, such as a symbol or a sign, maybe a word? When I regained control of myself after the murder, this symbol had been cut into my wrist with a knife. A snake. <laughs> Two open jaws. A snake. Oh dear God. Wow, that looks badass. <laughs> what does it mean? There's only one way for me to be sure. Please push me into the sitting room. I thought you said the shitting room, so I put you into the bathroom. Can I watch you take a shit? I'm gonna watch you take a shit. Alright. Please, watch me take a shit. It's very important for the divination. Hey, this is a kitchen, not a sitting room. Oh, I got a bonus, though. Uh, uh, shit, she's stuck. Oh, shit, she is stuck. Oh, uh, I, this is awkward. I can't get her out of the corner. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh, okay, back up, back up, back up, back up. Okay, 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 okay. Young man, you're making me clip into the wall. 
looked quite uncomfortable. Okay, what door is the sitting room? Let's push her outside into the cold snow. Okay, is this not the sitting room? You'll okay, find okay, some go, go, go. candles in one of the cupboards. Take them and place them in the candle holders. There should be some matches in the kitchen. Go find them and light the candles. No. <laughs> I didn't retain anything that she said. The clock has stopped. What did she say? Get the candles? Light the candles? What? My Adderall wore off. Okay, uh, now we can go... Uh, move around freely, I guess. Nothing in particular. Let's eat all of her food. Let's eat all of her fruit snacks. An old wood stove. Huh, the coffee pot is still hot. <laughs> That's an awfully hot pot. Old pop, plates pop, on pop, the pop. shelf. Man, why is he just talking shit about everything in this old An woman's old house? Sink. Everything is old and stupid looking in this lady's house. Wow, her house sucks. I hate it in here. Where are the candles? Probably not in the bird room. Maybe she uses the bird shit as the candle wax. Oh, chimney Christmas. Yeah, Lucas is kind of a catty bitch. His inner monologue is just constant, just bitching. Wait, that's the bird room again. I got turned around. This is like a Silent Hill game. Glamour time. Hey, hey, young man. What if the candles are in the sitting room? Nice rug. Where did you get that? Bed, bath, and beyond? Looks so tacky. Maybe I could take a look around in her little bedroom. The cupboard is locked. Okay. Panty red. I went into the old woman's wardrobe and started looking at all of her underwear. There were some with skid marks in them. <laughs> Strange. I start looking around in her bathroom and notice that she has a really old-timey toilet. <gasps> Please tell me he can pee pee in it. He can't. Brass bathtub? An antique. Must be at least a century or two old. Brass bathtub. That funky bathtub. Any a kennels? Old mirror hidden behind a sheet. It's like a medieval times toilet. Like really, really old toilet. Fucking 1800s ass kind of toilet. <laughs> Strange. This underwear smells fresh, but there's stains on it. I wonder why. The pH of this old woman's vagina must be out of whack. It's bleaching her underwear. Maybe the candles are in here. I found a candle. They kind of look like cheese sticks. The kind that you peel. Some people prefer to just eat them. In a few bites, but me, I like to gradually peel the cheese. As it's intended. I have the candles and I have the matches. Why did he put it on there like that? He did that in a really weird way. We don't have all night, young man! Jesus! Okay, okay, okay! Jesus, bro! I should have killed you when I had the chance. In the wheelchair section. 
I started taking a really long time to put the candles in the candle holders on purpose because I wanted to tick the old lady off and I was being a passive aggressive bitch about it. If you want it done right, do it yourself. Perfect. We're almost ready to begin. Turn off the light, close the curtains, and sit down next to me. No. You're weird. What if the old lady claps her hands and says, Come here, Martha! And her twin sister comes out, who's also an old Could you lady. Excuse me, tell me again what I'm supposed to do? I forgot. Turn off the light. Close and the they stop making it out. To me. Okay, the light switch is right here. Why does it look like that? It just looks like an apple embedded into the wall. Oh no, he's about to start some shit. Oh, uh, what do I do? How do I sit down? I don't know how to sit. Help. I can't. Bro, she's just hears him like running around the room frantically. Oh my god. Sit down, young man. Excuse me, could you tell me again what I'm supposed to do? Turn off the light, close the curtains, and sit down next to me. Close the light, turn off the curtains, and. Wait. Sit, close the. Sit down and turn off the. I don't have and... much time, Sonny! Oh my god, lady! Okay, 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 I did it, I did it, I did, I did everything you asked. I'm trying to walk... Don't you see? It's really hard for me to walk in this game, lady! I... Oh... Uh... Excuse me, could you tell me again what I'm supposed to do? Turn off the light, close there's the curtains, more curtains, and sit down next to me. I didn't know she meant curtains plural, as in there's multiple windows with curtains. I thought she meant curtains because, like, you don't call us, like, you don't say curtain, like, you don't say close the curtain. You. Uh... Oh, I can sit down. The only way to understand what has happened to you is to try to go deep into your unconscious memory. But I don't want to. Whoever it was that forced you to commit this murder has erased himself from your memory. But there still must be a trace in your unconscious. I can help you to locate it. I think he's it's getting an scammed. It's ceremony, and there's always a risk involved. Do you or do you not wish to try it? Uh, yes, I do. Give me your hands. What if he turns into an, another girl and they start now, touching each other's buttholes? Close your eyes. Oh. I want you to empty your mind and open wide the doors to your unconscious. <laughs> yeah, they're married now. <laughs> and let me enter there. <laughs> What if he married this That's old woman and they lived happily ever after? We're still together. Lucas, are you there? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I want you to. <laughs> what the f? <laughs> What's gonna happen now? Where are you, Lucas? I'm at the diner. I'm standing outside the restaurant. I want you to enter the restaurant now. No, I don't want to. I'm scared. Okay. I'm I'm opening up the door now. I can see it. The inside of the restaurant. It's a uh, Friday night. I'm ordering steak I've gone and fries. Into that restaurant. What do you see? I see some customers. And I see the waitress. Can you see the table where you were sitting? Yes. I'm looking. There's a police officer. He's sitting at the counter. Concentrate, Lucas. Come on, Lucas. Now, Stay with us. to your table. Fuck! Great. Hui hui. I'm 
standing next to my table, but it's empty. You haven't arrived and sat down there yet? Yes, I have. My meal is already on the table. I, I think this is when I murdered him. I... Stay calm, Lucas. I want you to tell me exactly where you are. I'm right next to my den then, I'm, and I'm getting hungry. I'm in the restroom. And so is the other man. He's taking a piss. What's he doing? He's urinating. He doesn't suspect anything. <laughs> and you, Lucas? He doesn't know. Where are you? I don't know. I can't see myself. There I am. I was in a toilet stall. Oh my god. I'm holding a knife. He doesn't see me. Oh. Calm yourself, Lucas. Keep your concentration. I... I so can't he really control was possessed. my steps. I'm walking up behind the man. He doesn't oh. see me. I don't want to. I don't want to, but I can't stop myself. I want you to leave <laughs> <into> the restaurant. <laughs> and then I do a really cool pose at the end. prior to going into the toilet stall. Do you understand, Lucas? Before. Lady, you're creeping me out. I don't want to tell you what I do in the toilet stall. It's essential that you keep your concentration, Lucas. Uh, you fuck. must empty your mind of all thoughts. Oh. Let's begin again. Again? No. Uh. Where are you now? I'm, uh... I'm in the restaurant dining room again. Okay. Are you sitting at your table? Yes, yeah? I am. I can see myself. What are you wearing? What are you doing, Lucas? <laughs> I'm eating. I'm eating and reading a what book. What are you doing? Where are you at, Lucas? Uh, I don't know. Yes. I'm just chilling. <laughs> you? Shakespeare. <laughs> oh, I'm just chilling. What else do you see? Yes, so, Lucas. <laughs> As I told you before, I am subject to a tyrant. A sorcerer that by his cunning hath cheated me of the island. What did you say? It's a passage from Shakespeare's Tempest. That's what you're reading, is what it not? What happened to his yes. voice? Someone's coming toward me. A man. Who is it? A customer? I don't know. I think so. I can't see his face. And what does he say to you? I, I... I don't know. I, I can't remember. You must concentrate, Lucas. You need to remember. Great. It's one of my favorite books. <laughs> it's the raincoat book. guy! You can see the... Oh, you can see days. it! Would this is the killer! I sat down for a moment? Ah, it's just the... Uh, weird vibes. And... Now the waitress is coming. Sir? David Cage. The coffee, please. That's that nice waitress. It's as if she didn't see the man, like he was invisible. Oh. So much has been written about the Tempest, especially concerning the theme of magic. Magic. And now, what's happening, Lucas? He's gonna give you powers, I, Lucas. I don't know. The man gives off a very strange energy. It's hard to describe. Go on, Lucas. What happens after that? Do you believe in the power of magic? Yes. No, I don't. Listen, um... No, that's gay. You're wrong. You know there's much more to our universe than can be perceived by the naked eye. Your coffee, sir. Thanks, Kate. Wait, he responded to her, but... Oh, God. The waitress has brought him his coffee. But she's talking to me as if I was the one who ordered it. She doesn't know that he's there. She can't see him. And now what's happening? Listen, what's I don't want to be rude, but I'd rather eat alone. Naster Naktilan Nekathanekli Kortniklan Narniklan Nekmesta Apani Pani Oh my god, Pearl, you just got imbued with ancient power. What the fuck? I'm paralyzed. Not cool. I can't feel my body. I can't 
can't move. Oh, no, he really did get possessed. The man, Lucas. Where is the man? Who is this man? He, he stood up. He's gone out. He's in my head now. He controls me. Follow the man, Lucas. Hurry. I command you to follow that man closely. Follow the man. Follow him. I've lost my memory again. Fuck! Just relax, Lucas. Your unconscious mind doesn't want to remember. It's defending itself. But you must win over this resistance. He's overwrought. Begin again. Come on, Lucas, hang in there. He's going out the rear Protect door. Protect your mental elf. Follow him. Your mind and his are now linked. You can see what he sees. Yes, I can see him. He's leaving the diner. He's walking into the road. Where's he going? Oh, my vision is getting foggy. What? It's that guy that you killed. Oh, his mental health is too bad. Man was, don't you, Agatha? No. I don't know. Yeah, you do. I'm not sure who he is. Yeah, you yes, do. Yes, you do know who he is. You do know, yeah. You understood it all as soon as you felt the scars on my arms. What do these symbols mean, Agatha? Tell me what that man's done to me. You should go now, Lucas. There's nothing more that I can do for you. Says you. You could at least explain what the hell's happening to me. He made me kill a man. I want to know. I need to know. I have to verify certain things. There's nothing more I can tell you today. No. Come back tomorrow <gasps> night at the same time. His mental elf got better. Then. Plus 20 mental elf. Let's go. Let's go, Lucas. Yeah! Fuck. Okay. I'm going to switch to Carla and just see what's going on. How much longer do you think we have in this game? We're definitely not beating it tonight. Maybe next stream? Training Sergeant Mitchell? That's him, in the second to last row. Thanks. Oh, she's at the range. I went to one of these places IRL. It's so scary. It's so loud. I was so terrified that one of the bullets was gonna ricochet and kill me. Sergeant Mitchell? Yes? I'm Inspector Carla Valenti. Would you mind if I asked you a few questions concerning really, like, one of my halfway? investigations? Young lady, I haven't worked in investigations for Not a long time. Not even halfway. I doubt I can be much help. Wait, yeah, I can't be on too case, long tonight. I'm still looking into it. The Kirsten case? Yeah, where's because the ear protection, the Carla? Is that right? Yes, that's right. The file's been classified. How'd you like to do some target practice with me? Sure. Why not? She doesn't... She doesn't even have... Okay, put your protective gear on. Whoa, she looks cool. She looks like the wicked emo. Your gun is right in it's front of you. It's Doctor Disrespect. <laughs> no, that's Sergeant Mitchell. You idiot. <laughs> Wait, get it. But why does she have her finger on the trigger? She's so bad. Terrorist innocence. Is that a terrorist? I can't tell. That's an innocent. Their hands are up. Plus three. Uh, God, aiming with controller is so hard. Fuck. Fuck. I'm a bad police officer. You get more points if you hit them in like the vital area. Oh shit. <laughs> it's not about points. It's about saving them. Oh shit. I. I don't have any bullets. I I actually ran out of bullets, Sawi. Sawi. Looks like the tail is swam. The way you shoot, you really should come back for some more training. Uh, oh. So, what do you want to know about the Kirsten case? How well, embarrassing. Instance, what exactly happened? I need more Guy bullets. Named Kirsten's calmly shopping in his local supermarket. He's in the kitchen accessories aisle when someone picks up a knife and stabs him. A mental to death. elf. Poor Carla. Was the killer apprehended? He didn't move from the spot. We found him sitting on the floor next to the victim, like he was waiting for us. 
with this uh. blank stare on his face. What the? Maybe he just cracked, lost it for a moment. Some people are like time bombs just waiting to go off. That's yeah, the first that's theory right. I had, until I saw the coroner's report. Each knife entry cut cleanly into an artery, leading to the heart with perfect accuracy. Precision like that, I mean, the guy had a one in a million chance of doing that, even what? if he'd been a surgeon. Just like... Did he have any history of drug addiction? Or previous psychiatric problems? It's just like the That's current the first case. That's angle I looked into, but no. No drugs, no drinking, just a very normal Joe. His Family body man, language is like a kid, woman? What do you neighbor. mean by that? Like he's like sassy and feminine? Yeah, they should be shouting through this entire thing for it to be realistic. Did the, was the killer on any drugs? What was what was going on? What? What'd you say? Oh fuck! This time I'm gonna kill all of them. Here comes the man in black. Galaxy defenders. Pew pew pew. The man in black. Oh fuck! Nine out of ten terrorists. Let's go. Oh, ten out of ten terrorists. 10 out of 12? Why is... Why does the number keep going up? My precision is 83% though, so that's kind of cool. But, uh, I got 10 seconds and I ran out of bullets. I'm out of bullet Pushing the right stick... <gasps> you can reload! I didn't read that in the tutorial, because I only read the first sentence, and my mind shut off for the rest of it because I simply do not want to read. Should a mentally sensible woman on the verge of a panic attack because she can't find the circuit breaker be allowed to operate a gun? I don't think so, yeah. Wait, are you talking about me or about the video game character? Okay, he's totally gonna be impressed. Reload! I recommend that you come back for some more target practice. The what? way you shoot, you're likely to hurt someone out there. Really? You didn't stop your investigation there, did you? <laughs> you really suck, Carla. No, this case really intrigued me. What could have Everyone at the police station actually hates like you that? and thinks you're bad yeah, at your job. Out piles of leads and and discovered almost by accident that this wasn't the first. There had been other killings with the same profile. He you does kind of have like a feminine posture. And stuck around afterwards? Exactly. Three weeks earlier, on the other side of town, another stabbing victim in the middle of the street, no more <laughs> air, <laughs> discovered a third case. Two months prior to that. Then another, and another, and always the same M.O. Always. And in all these cases, the perp was arrested? I nope. like that word. Either perp. they committed suicide before we got there, or else they went nuts. But each time, the stabbing was identical. They all cut the arteries leading to the heart very precisely. What? Then they carved a snake on their own forearms. <gasps> the snake! And your investigation into the supermarket killing. Did it lead anywhere? You should drop this one, Detective. What? This Why? This is not just a murder case. There's something very odd going on behind the scenes. Looks like I'll be starting a new file. Oh no, it's just gonna shoot really badly again. He <laughs> just misses every shot. <laughs> I've worked good and hard on the investigation. Done oh, fuck yeah! <gasps> He's gonna now get his $200 just want to back! Play some b -ball. And also settle the score <laughs> I had with you. wearing? <laughs> They're just gonna play b ball in the snow? <laughs> oh, fuck yeah. Make fun. Yo, nice threads, Jeffrey. Very stylish, my man. Yeah, I like the glasses. Totally psyched out and that shit. He swore. Right. Okay, here's the rules. First to score 10 points wins the game and $200. Should I have At warmed up instead of talking you shit? You kiss your money goodbye. We'll see. Let's whoa, do it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> All right, let's beat his ass. Whoa, 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 oh, oh. Boom, boom. <laughs> Tyler. Oh, he 
pulled a muscle on his arm. What a loser. La who the hurt? Alright, check this shit out. Ooh. Always do doing some topsy turvy kind of stuff. Look out! Look out, Jeffrey! Ooh, Jeffrey! Did you see that slam dunk? That was so cool. Alright, Jeffrey. Enough playing around. We're gonna do it epic style. Yay! Yay, Tyler! This is the male experience. <gasps> oh! I got another Dunkarino! Oh, I'm so heckin' proud of myself. The more I see you play, Jeffrey, the more I think you should take up chess. <laughs> Cause he's a nerd. I love this royalty-free funky music. Yes. Now that was pure poetry in motion. Yeah, like Shakespeare or something. <laughs> take this. All right, all right, all right, Jeffrey, all right. Maybe I'll go easy on you. Oh, psych! Fuck you, Jeffrey. Fuck you, Jeffrey. Oh, take that, try this one for size. Put that in your pipe and smoke it. I think you're all that in a bag of chips, don't you, Jeffrey? I'm gonna take my money and I'm gonna take it home and play video games with it. Because that's what I do. I'm Tyler and I'm a cool guy. Some of the, like, if you ever get really anxious in life, some of the best things to do is just imagine that you're a really cool guy. I'm being 100% serious. Just like, if you get really scared or anxious or depressed, just think inside your mind like, okay, what if I was a really cool guy though? And I, I just like, did not give a shit. It works, it actually works. What if I'm just like a cool, nonchalant, kind of swell, See, funky late. dude? He drives and he scores! Ladies and gentlemen, that's our play of the day! Fuck you, Jeffrey! Yo, you D up pretty good for a white cop. <laughs> you ain't so bad yourself. You got some game. Maybe I should have mentioned. Magic I did Jeffrey. In college. So, as for the hundred, it's game over, man. Uh oh. You're a real SOB, Tyler. I know, and that's why you like me, Jeffrey. And then what if they started making out? <laughs> okay, let's go to Lucas's apartment and save the game. Wait, I'm kind of curious, like, Carla's at Carla's place right now. I wonder what Carla's place is like. Yeah, what if we did a rematch and then whoever gets the most Dunkarinos gets to have a little kiss on the cheek? Who's calling me at this hour? Hello? You know what time it is? Lucas Kane. Master Lucas Kane. <laughs> oh, it's another fucking telemarketer. God damn it. I told you to stop calling me. Put me on the no call list. Oh, what the fuck? I was like, oh, I'll just go back to Lucas's apartment and save the game and he'll probably just like go to sleep. What the fuck is happening? Why is everything... Why is my apartment in zero gravity mode? What, is there a hurricane? This is just craziness. <gasps> Lucas, look out. Ah! Okay, he did it. I have to dodge all my ex-girlfriend's stuff. Ugh. No, the ch 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 chair. Oh shit! <gasps> oh. I'm not getting my deposit back. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Set. No, 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 no! Wait, I just want to see him get hit by something. <laughs> Oh my god! No, not my cabinets! 
Oh my god, my landlord's gonna be pissed! Oh shit, oh look out! He has some pretty good reflexes. <laughs> Just kidding, that's me doing the QTEs. I'm the one who's actually good at it. But you guys are all like, Oh wow, look at Lucas doing all this cool stuff. He looks so cool doing all this. Wow, he's doing it all by himself. Meanwhile, I'm the one mashing the buttons. And nobody cares. Typical. Fucking typical. Yeah! Remember. Remember what you've learned, Lucas. You can do it, Lucas. Turn on Theory of a Dead Man on your stereo. It'll help. Come on, Lucas. You can do it. Come on, brother. Just imagine that you're a really cool guy. You can do anything if you imagine you're a really cool guy. Would a really cool guy get scared by all this furniture flying at him? No. He'd be too cool for that. He'd just be like, <laughs> Clean up on IO3. Oh shit! Ah! Look out! Lucas, get down! You're in trouble! How. How long is this segment? How much, how much stuff does he have in his apartment to fly at him? Bro, just open the door. Hurry! Oh no. Ah, Lucas! Hang on, Lucas! Yeah, what if the entire, like, rest of the game, like, five more hours is just this sequence that never ends? You think it's over? It's like... And then just the music starts up again and more things start flying at him. And then the old lady shows up and another old lady shows up and they both start making out. And covering each other in mayonnaise. And she's like, Ah, Lucas, don't look! You're such an edgy, sketchy, one-touchy! And then the, the Chinese guy from the library shows up and is like, Hey! I'm the Chinese guy from the library! He was just doing it to be a, a jerk. He is just a regular guy from the Bronx. Oh my god! Do you know how much rent is in New York? This is like a fucking six hundred thousand million dollar a month apartment. Not my guitar. Oh my god! This is like Kingdom Hearts level of storytelling. It's crazy. Run, Lucas. Just keep running. Don't give up, Lucas. Oh, no. No! Why is he laughing evilly? His story haunted me all night long. I had to see him. So talk. that's how my story I had to ends. Find out what Agatha had told him. I wanted to look my brother ah! in the eye and hear the truth. <laughs> never been to his apartment before, and it took me some time to find it. That was some fine button-pressing pink cat. I did it. Oh, he is actually hanging on for dear life. On the balcony. I can't seem to find his apartment. <laughs> Strange, I don't really remember what apartment number he's in. Lucas Kane, that's it. Uh, ring the doorbell? Lucas, yell for help! Lucas, be like, ah! Why doesn't he go, ah? <sighs> Lucas, Lucas, open the door! Lucas, open the door! Lucas! Lucas! Oh no, it's locked, isn't I it? I swear that I heard a scream coming from inside. The doorman said Lucas was at home, but he isn't opening. Maybe he's playing a video game and getting Lucas really mad danger. about I've it. I've got no other choice. Lucas? 
Lucas? Lucas! Lucas! Oh my god! Okay. Uh, he's just a priest, but he should have upper body strength, right? Because he lives for the Lord. Yay! We saved him. My uh, brother. Lucas, for God's sake. Have you lost your mind? What's come over you? The walls... The walls were blown away, and the wind, the tempest, I... Why did you do this, the Lucas? Tempest. Why? Like the Shakespeare Somebody tried to kill book. me. For heaven's sake, Lucas. There's no one else here but you and I. You were all alone when I arrived. All alone, Lucas. <laughs> what's happening to me, Marcus? I don't know what's happening. I don't get it. It'll be all right, Lucas. Everything will be fine. I'm gonna help you. I'm gonna help you. You'll see. We're gonna start making out, Lucas. Aww. It's so cute. They are brothers. Ah, uh, don't look! Don't look, don't look, don't look. Don't. Wait, she doesn't have any nipples. What the fuck? I'm not kidding. I don't think she was born with nipples. Who just like lounges around their apartment listening to this kind of music? I feel like that's kind of psychopathic. Okay, now I'm just gonna jog around in my underwear for a little bit. Looks like she has a stain on her butt. So she farted too hard in her underwear, I think. I'm gonna walk around my apartment in my underwear while listening to sed seductive French music. Who's calling me? Where's the f is the phone? Where's the phone? Does she have stuffed animals? Sure took your time. I was in the shower. What do you got? I got nothing. Dead end. Impossible to ID the page marker found in the book from the restaurant. It's got a series of numeric codes written on it, but it just looks like a lot of numbers to me. I, I thought you might have some ideas. Why don't you fax it to me? I wasn't tired anyway. I'm sure it'll make for good bedtime reading. Okay, I'll send it now. If you get any brainstorms, give me a ring. I'll be here for a while. Tonight's oh, gonna be a Lucas long... had a brainstorm earlier. Okay, talk to you later, Tyler. A real one. Jesus Christ, did it get louder? Wait, what is this picture on the wall? Fury. Whoa, she has a really high tech apartment. Uh, these candles over here are a fire hazard. That is a cinema sin. I'm gonna make Carla eat so much food. Drink the milk, Carla. Drink it. She has nothing. She has Jeff pizza. Jeff Super Pizza Man! <laughs> Eating a slice of pizza gives you plus five to your mental elf. It's true. It's true enough. Wait, I'm tired of being a lady walking around in her underwear. What's Tyler up to? Working overtime. He's adulting. Normally, I don't like leaving Sam home alone, especially now. But this Go bookmark home. had me intrigued. I had a gut feeling that I was holding the key that would identify our killer. I felt like I was closing in on him, and I wasn't about to go home to sleep until I figured out. <laughs> what, what if this we switch to Tyler meant? and he's wearing like a bra and panties and listening to like, ah, uh, uh, music? <laughs> Sometimes I like to walk around in a bra and panties in the, the police office. Kinda helps me think. <laughs> He's just walking around like this. <laughs> I wanna make 
me call a go poo poo. Let me call a go poo poo on the toilet. Call a poo poo on the toilet. Call a go poo poo. Call a go big poo poo. Call a go big poo poo on the toilet. Call a. Call a. If you switch between them too many times, they just switch outfits and they're like, oh, wait. <laughs> Great, now one of us has to change. She has like a little girl's bedroom. Why is that? I'm just a girl. I haven't had such a cold winter in ages. What was that? What was she doing? <laughs> everything is silent, motionless, as if everything was dead. Hope it doesn't last long. Yeah, where's her toilet? To expose all she knows you play like teeth. How do you save? Auto save on Just a girl. What's her her status? 30% of the story completed? Only 30? Jesus, this game is long! Actually, I'm happy. I'm happy that there's still so much of this game left. I want to savor it all. I want to like it. Just completely immerse myself. Whoa, who's at the door? Awkward. Who could that be at this hour? Not expecting anyone. Uh, put some clothes on, Carla. Shit. Okay, we're going to find out who's on the other side of the door. I have to get level 60 in World of Warcraft and then go eat dinner. <laughs>